Echo Soldier just subscribed. Does anybody I know? heard that. Oh, I can. Not worth it at all, though. He sells them for five dollars. Or the pots, sorry. Yeah, that's what I meant. I guess that's because, yeah, because they're broken. I'm just gonna sell all the nits. Fuck them. I can't be bothered with the nits. I'll get the money that I uh, that I need right now. Maybe I'll need them for some quests, and then I'll I'll get back to them. But for now, I'm not really keen on the nits. Okay. Every time I go to this store, for some reason I think, ah, oh, Papanada is what she's going to say. I don't even remember what game that's from. But she always does the, <sighs> when you first open the store. That's Hollow Knight, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Any day now, guys. Any day now. What do you think we'll release first? Three options. Silk Song, the next book of A Song of Ice and Fire, or The Doors of Stone from the King Killer Chronicles. Mass Effect 3. Okay, four options. <laughs> Five options, Half-Life 3. <laughs> Fuck, dude. There's stuff I've been waiting for for a long time. Approach a hooded figure, sway, uh, swathe, or swathed, I don't know. In dark... He was wearing... And... You, thank you. Exploring. <laughs> this is what I get for, uh... At night! You can enter your- I know, yeah, thank you. Did he kill my engine, guys? Rip engines? Yeah, yeah, thank you. Yeah, that cleaned up a lot of my storage here. Fantastic. Uh, playing CS quite a bit over here. Over here. Boom! Oh, you're actually right. <laughs> That's so funny, I didn't think that would work. Do I want to- Not even cloth, guys. Fuck up the local populace. Yeah, whatever. Yeah. That'd be it for me for today. Reminder. Go to the bomb man. Boom! Oh, your box at full speed. I had no idea. I am now going to do this every single time. I'm giving my opponent a lot of time here. I don't think that's ideal, but... Really? Oh god, what a mess. Oh my god, dude, I threw this. I didn't realize my units were coming in from that angle over there. That's not great. I should still have enough to hold this back. But that was not great. Those are gonna be really good here. Okay, that was a horrible engagement just now, but I think he threw away more units as well to justify it all. Um, I have 85 drones at this point. That's pretty good. Ho 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 ho, Ultraman, where are you going? <laughs> Look at my micro, incredible micro right now on the other side of the- Okay, wait, no. I wasn't even looking at it. Yay! Operation, don't play like an idiot! Complete it! 
Thank you, Maz, for the 53 months. Appreciate it. Thank you, Silux, as well, for the 43. Cool stream as well with the resub. One game. Pretty insane, dude. All games today, if you don't count. <laughs> Playing StarCraft 2 pretty sick. I think that's pretty... Oh, man, I'm exhausted. <laughs> <laughs> Playing StarCraft 2 is insane, man. You play two games, you're like, Ugh, months. I need to take a nap. Not even in my Ferrari. Over 300 APM, you're now an honorary German Autobahn driver? Really? I don't think I've ever gone 300 kilometers in a car, ever. Nope, not even close. Not even in my Ferrari. Not even in my McLaren. What cars can even go 300 kilometers an hour? Look at my micro. Incredible micro right now on the other. Thank you, LRS. Three. Hell yeah. Thank you, LRS. Cool stream as well with the resub. Hell yeah. All during the last seven minutes? Seven minutes. Show us your APM, Loco. One million. There it is, man. If you round it up to a million, it's one million. I'm on a winning streak of one game. Pretty insane, dude. Quite a bit lower in MMR than my previous opponent, though. I won all games today, if you don't count the ones that I lost. So that's pretty sick. I oh man, I'm exhausted. <laughs> <laughs> Playing StarCraft 2 is insane, man. You play two games, you're like, oh, I need to take a nap. Thank you, Nico, for the 20 months. Welcome back. Over 300 APM, you're now an honorary German Autobahn driver? Really? I don't think I've ever gone 300 kilometers in a car, ever. Nope, not even close. Car, ever. Nope. Not even close. Not even in my Ferrari. Not even in my McLaren. What cars can even go th I know. What cars can even go 300 kilometers an hour? Yeah, I'm not even sure. Some Bugattis or some shit, I guess. Mula One cars, I get that. <laughs> Two or 417? Bugatti on the Autobahn? Bro, that is... I'm not even sure. Two or 417? Bugatti on the Autobahn? Bro, that is such a bad idea. 417 kilometers an hour? That is gen genuinely a, just a stupid idea. Like, the Autobahn is pretty good quality. But, um, yeah. Oh, I don't think, like, in some locations, I don't, don't quote me on this, okay? Don't do it as an... Oh, and I don't think, like, in some locations, I don't, don't quote me on this, okay? Don't do it as an income to me. But I know that <laughs> some places in, places in Germany, there's no, there's no speed limit. There's an advised limit. But, yeah. But what if there's another car, bro? Okay, so this is 374 kilometers an hour. Advice speed in, in Germany is 130 kilometers an hour. This guy's taking two lanes too! Oh my god. That's insane, man. Literally one bump in the road? And he's super fucked, no? And he's super fucked. Super f no? I don't know how- I, uh, I don't know how speed works like this, but like... 
If there's not even a slow car, man. If there's a if there's no. If there's not even a slow car, man. If there's a if there's a car going like a hundred kilometers an hour, like seventy miles an hour, he's not gonna be able to see it. Like, what is the how much how long does it take to break? Going from four hundred kilometers to a hundred without slamming the brakes. How long does that take? That's insane, man. If he if he breaks too hard, he's gonna slide like crazy. Four hundred kilometers an hour is hundred and ten meters a second. So it's gonna take him at least a kilometer to break. What if the guy sneezes? <laughs> Seriously, man. She's such stupid fucking me. She's such stupid fucking It's so dumb. But yeah, I guess technically there are cars that, uh, you know, don't take off. <laughs> Genuinely, if he sneezes, he'll pass 200 meters. It is very easy to accidentally sneeze for like a second and a half, no? <laughs> There's probably a brake assist, yeah. But still, I'd imagine so. I don't know how, how expensive a car like this is. Bugatti Chiron? 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 I don't know. 2.6 million euro is the first thing I see over here. That's the cheapest version. I don't think anybody's out there buying the cheapest Bugatti. Bugatti Chiron starts at 2.6. Who's, who's buying the 2.6 million edition though? That's easy money for a Twitch streamer loco? Oh yeah, yeah, of course. I don't really know much about supercars. I don't really know much about cars in general. This is what it looks like? I mean, it's kind of... This is what it looks like. This is what it looks like? I mean, it's kind of cool. I'm trying to think of like how much money you need to have before you're like, yeah, yeah $2.6 million on a car. Like give or take $3 million. Uh, whatever, we round it up, round it down, whatever. It looks, yeah, but like, at what point do you care? <laughs> You'd buy it as soon as you have $2.7 million? I don't think so, man. Maybe it's uh, maybe it's one of those things where it appreciates rather than depreciates. I know it with cars, it's a little funky, but they probably don't make a whole lot of them. I can imagine even if you were to sit on $3 million for no apparent reason, and you, you're like, you know, really keen to buy one, you probably can't. I don't know how it works, but, uh... Oh, only about 500 have ever been sold. Considered to be one of the rarest cars in the world. Okay, yeah, there's no way. You literally won't be able to buy one. <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> you never understood the point of these and you work in the automotive industry? Yeah. How do you insure it? Well... Well, I I think I think there will be many companies happy to insure your fucking Bugatti, man. To insure your your fucking your fucking share your fucking your fucking Bugatti. Or your fucking Bugatti, man. <laughs> or your fucking Bugatti, man. <laughs> they'll be, uh, they'll be happy to get you, but, uh, yeah. It's just expensive. 
Expensive. They all appreciate pretty wildly. That's nuts. Most expensive is a Rolls Royce. Isn't Bugatti more expensive than a Rolls Royce? The most expensive is a Rolls Royce. Isn't Bugatti more expensive than a Rolls Royce? I heard they're making a completely um, electric Rolls Royce, apparently. <laughs> Which is uh, interesting. Yeah, that's what I, uh, I saw like a news article where apparently they're introducing it sometime this year. His dream car is a bicycle, of course. In the Netherlands. We uh, only have bicycles. That's what we do. <laughs> Loco doesn't have a car. He did a ho He's got a horse. Some pretty cool electric bicycles out there these days, guys. Unironically, electric bikes are actually kind of hype. Actually, kind of cool, dude. I don't need one, cause you know. I don't need one, because, you know, I have a really good bike and I don't really use it as often as I should, but electric bikes are pretty sick. More money for the Bugatti fund. <laughs> I will never get a Bugatti potato measure. That's what I was trying to think of just now, right? Like, imagine at some point, like, how much money do you need to have before you get a fucking Bugatti? Need to have before you get a fucking before you get a f***ing Bugatti. You need to base- like, that's like yacht levels of money, right? Like, the guy that has three yachts, that's the guy that buys a Bugatti. But I think yachts are already stupid, so like, I can't- I, I don't even- I, I, I don't get it. Anyways, thank you very much for the 108 months. Is that a round number? Hold up. 108 divided by 12? That's nine years! A nine year sub? Bro, that's actually nuts. Nine years, potato. I like how nobody noticed that that was a round number. <laughs> we we all can't we can't count past sixty, okay? When we get to seventy-two, nobody knows how years work out after seventy-two. How many months is in a eight? I don't know. We don't know. Hey, thank you, potato. That is genuinely, uh, genuinely, uh, incredibly generous of you. Chet, I have to go on a date, but I don't want to leave my apartment. Not sure if flex or introverted. Can't tell, LRS. Maybe both? Yeah, maybe both. Going on dates is kind of scary, though. For, like, first you're really excited that she said yes, and then you're like, fuck, now I have to go on a date, too. For some reason, that's not part of the equation. You're like, oh, yeah, ooh, da, yeah, ooh, and then you realize, oh, God, now I actually have to, <laughs> now I need to go and actually plan something. Invite him over to play Mario. The absolute worst game. Well, one of the worst games, period. Okay. But, uh, play Twister. Cool. Woohoo! We almost. Not. Oh, he sacked his own re. It's a little embarrassing. Uh, that was, uh. Saturation, but. <sighs> So I thought it'd be okay. Stream sniping coming. <laughs> I should build a wall and make them pay for it. That's pretty clever. Why has nobody thought of that? Cyril's using your emotes in Showtime's channel. <laughs> nice. Big knob. <laughs> God. I thought he typoed noob, but it's actually kind of funny. Sounds like a wrestling name. Stream snipe incoming. No, stream snipe was the previous game. It's okay, guys. As long as we. Ha <laughs> Ha! 
Ha 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 What's this? This guy definitely didn't know I was streaming, guys. Like, if he thought I was going 12 pool, I don't think this build is ideal. I'm not an expert, but, um... I'm not an expert, but, um... Actually, maybe I am an expert. Hold up right now. Hold up right now. Um, so I don't really know how this plays out right now. He must realize that I've got a Roach Warrant too, right? So he proxied the gateway over here and actually made units out of it? <sighs> yeah, streaming StarCraft at this MMR is a bit tricky, guys. Sub costs two five euro. Coincidence? I think oh, what? not. Two two five euros. <laughs> how would how did I make a drone? I wasn't meaning to make a drone. That sucks. Yeah, we're fucked, guys. How did I make a drone. I wasn't. That sucks. Yeah, we're fucked, guys. Sub costs two five euro. Coincidence? I think oh, what? not. what? Five euro? <laughs> Are you kidding me, Loco? Oh my god, I'm so bad. Are you kidding me, Loco? Oh my god, I'm so bad. So this guy assumes that I'm going for a 12 pool. And then he, he decides to go for a, a, a cannon rush. I don't think that's ideal, guys. Don't think so. Hey, thank you very much, Volfox. Thank you, Mutester, as well for the nine. Or for the, uh, sorry, the eight months. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. <sighs> mm -mm. Now he's whispering me after the game. Did you win, Loco? Yes, I won. Did you win, Loco? Yes, I won very hard. Yeah. <sighs> the thing is, if I go for a 12 pool, I auto counter that build, right? There's nothing he can do if I go 12 pool. So the fact that he pool. So the fact that he knows I like the 12 pool and then goes for a forge first. And then he asks if I'm streaming too. It all feels a, fi a bit fishy. I don't want to make any calls. But uh, it definitely does feel a little fishy, that's for sure. If I went 12 pool there, you can't really lose. I feel like if I did go for a 12 pool though, you probably would have not gone for a cannon rush. I've got a feeling that wouldn't have been a forge first if I did go for a pool first. But maybe, maybe you just me. You never know, could be coincidence. Maybe if I built like two to five spines per base, it would have been okay, you know? Uh, I'm playing on my... Would have been okay, you know? Two to five spines per base, it would have been okay, you know? Uh, I'm playing on my main account because I got tired of switching accounts. <laughs> it's a proper first world problem, man. But to be fair, if you see me queuing up, 
Yeah, exactly. People don't don't really need to know my nickname that well. It doesn't really matter that much. It's okay. It happens. Maybe shy guy. We'll see, man. I do. I do. When I play my main account, I don't know if this is true. This can be a bit frustrating. The ladder. Now we take the gas. Pretty late gas is here. How else did I lose? Ooh, this is nicely done by him. It's good against basically every opener. <clears throat> I'm gonna go Spire here. I haven't really lost drones. It's okay. It happens. I haven't really lost drones. <clears throat> I'm gonna go Spire here. Good against basically every opener that isn't a Stargate. Ooh, this is nicely done by him. Oh no, how many drones did I lose? Yes. <laughs> what a mess. <laughs> no, get him drones. Okay, I got him. My queens weren't all attacking there. I think it would have been better if my queens were attacking. Just a hunch. Okay. It's a Colossus. A jerk. Colossus. A giraffe. You know what? I'll catch these units if you don't mind. Oh, Protoss. Oh, Recall. Oh, I made a mistake. Never mind. Oh, Protoss. Oh, Recall. Oh, I made a mistake. Never mind. Oh, Protoss. Oh, Recall. Oh, I made a mistake. Never mind. Oh, Protoss. Oh, Recall. Oh, I made a mistake. Never mind. Oh, Protoss. Oh, Recall. Oh, I made a mistake. Never mind. That's what you sound like when you recall your whole army like that! I'm sorry, I hate to break it to you, man! Oh, I made a mistake. Oh, never mind. Oh, I made a mistake. Oh, never mind. Whoopsie daisies. <laughs> that was embarrassing. Never mind. Ay, ay, ay. Hello, good sir. What is going on, Declan? They have a fucking control plus. Z. They have a fucking control. control. They have a control plus Z command, dude. Insane. Insane. Uh, this is all kind of rough. I don't. So there's definitely gonna be uh, disruptors on the back of this, right? And I don't really have anything good against this. Oh, Protoss. Oh, recall. Oh, I made a mistake. Never mind. That's what you sound like when you recall your whole army like that! Oh, Protoss. Oh, recall. Oh, I made a mistake. Never mind. Oh, Protoss. Oh, recall. Oh, I made a mistake. Never mind. Oh, Protoss. Oh, recall. Oh, I made a mistake. Never mind.
You sound like when you recall your whole army like that. I'm sorry. I hate to break it to you, man. Oh, my mistake. Oh, never mind. Whoopsie daisies. <laughs> that was embarrassing. Never mind. Insane. And good against this rep. I think he just took that high ground base, didn't he? Oh, he what? He didn't make disruptors? Didn't kill that Colossus? Actually, maybe that's the origin. No, he didn't make disruptors. I was gonna say. I'd be very surprised. Hello? <sighs> Hello? Okay. He just took his entire army and attack moved. That was a surprising move. Okay. <sighs> What's up, Bruce? Good morning, Loco. We're at a year and a half together. Happy anniversary. <laughs> this guy thought he could just grab his army in a tech move. What does he think he is? A Zerg? Embarrassing, man. I can't do that as Protoss. You gotta actually use hotkeys. With Zerg, Zerg, F2A move. If you F2 a little too much, get Burrow. Right? So you can block the expansions regardless. Thank you very, very much, Brusik. Thank you also, Declan, for the five months. I appreciate you. What's up, Wargunner? Welcome, welcome. Thank you for the 41 as well. Appreciate it, guys. Thank you. Yeah, to, so basically starting today, we're back to the regular schedule, okay? I feel like I've been very... But, um... Am I an enabler? Did I... What? Honestly, I don't like this type of recall, okay? I like Loco. What did I do? Wait, we have a clip of Loco's Mickey Mouse impression. Now we have Kermit the Frog. What? I appreciate you. Wait, we have a clip of Loco's Mickey Mouse impression. Now we have Kermit the Frog. What? What did I do? Oh, Protoss. Oh, Going to oh, spin. I made a mistake. Never mind. How is your Spanish? Moi esta loco. What's going on, Alex? Thank you for the 11. Welcome. Bro, fucking... This is so... It, I honestly... I don't like this type of recall. Welcome. Bro, fucking... Bro, this is so- I honestly- I don't like this type of recall, okay? I like recall most of the time. This like, oh shit, I am out in the- This like, oh shit. Like, oh shit. This like, oh shit. Oh shit. Like, oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. This like, oh, I am out on the map. Oh shit, never mind. Oh, shit, oh shit. Oh shit, never mind. Got the Control Plus Z button. I, I'm yeah, I'm not a fan of that one. Thank you, Ace. Gifting us up to Jumpy, but it's okay. I would have done the same if I was him. Every day. We get closer to a loco deep fake Muppets film. Every day we stray further from God. From God. I haven't unbent everybody in a while. Slash unbent all. Six users? Ay, ay, ay. There it is, man. I think three of these six tried selling their OnlyFans in the chat. I don't know if this happens to like regular Twitch users too, but I get I get people reaching out to me in Twitch DMs. Asking me to subscribe to their OnlyFans. I'm not sure why. Is that a thing? Why is that is that something that happens to Do they only do that to streamers or is that a thing you get I'm not sure. Thank you, Bruce Sick. Is 
It's on onlyfans.com slash TV. Ah, the page is not available. GG. It happens only to you, Loco. You're special. My mom told me I was special. Yeah, man, you don't have to sub, but I'd appreciate it. <laughs> Were you the one, Cocos? I knew it. It's just that $14.99 was kind of a lot, you know? I think I want to watch that. Yo, since you're back, he linked the video. I made Twitch chat narrate a nature documentary. Oh. Gabe, what is this? Gabe? Gabe, what is this? Gabe, what is this? Yo, yo, since you're back, he linked the video. I made Yo, yo, since you're back. He linked the video. I made Twitch chat narrate a nature documentary. Oh god, I don't think I want to do this, man. I don't think this is what I want to be doing with my life. I don't. I don't think I want to watch that. I think I'm good, man. In case you ever want to do some trolling with VTubing, I wasn't planning on it. I, I was not planning on it. Share it with the class. Okay, fine. I'll click it. Follow up to my recent video, I turned Twitch chat into an anime girl. If you haven't seen that yet, go watch it and then come back to this one. But we can go over the basics just in case. Meet Kana, the anime girl who reads out Twitch chat message redeems from my viewers. She always says the most upbeat. Yeah, I actually think this guy is kind of clever, man. So this guy has this anime girl as a VTuber th thing, right? But he is actually not the anime girl. He is the little octopus on his head. Or her head. That's really kind of clever. I actually think that's really quite smart. <laughs> and apparently, they figured out a way to make the anime girl say the messages in Twitch chat out loud. And wholesome things. I know, about 20 if I years. 100 bits, will you fart for me? Okay. Big fart. <laughs> okay, no, I'm good. I've seen enough of that fucking video. And wholesome things. I know, about 20 if I years. 100 bits, will you fart for me? Okay, your cops, big fart. <laughs> okay, no, no, I'm good. I've seen enough of that fucking video. Enough of that fucking And wholesome things. I know, about if 20 I years. 100 bits, will you fart for me? Okay, your cops, big fart. <laughs> okay, no, I'm good. I've seen enough of that video, Gabe. Gabe, that was too much. Your clip privileges have once again been revoked. Do we have exclamation point, Gabe? Command, edit, Gabe, certified. What you're about Some things. I know, about Twenty if I years. One hundred bits. Will you fart for me? Okay, your cops, big fart. <laughs> okay, no, I'm good. I've seen enough of that video, Gabe. Gabe, that was too much. Your clip privileges have once again been revoked. Do we have exclamation point, Gabe? Command, edit, Gabe. Sort of point, Gabe. Gabe, command, edit, Gabe, certified boomer. Oh yeah, that's when he heard his back. I remember that. Loco from the future, remind yourself, don't open his video links. I fall for it every time, dude. Okay, uh, what's this? Edzilla. I don't know what I'm looking at. I've <laughs> I've no idea what I'm looking at. <sighs>
photorealistic, man. That was beautiful. Photorealistic, man. I've... I don't know what I'm looking at. I thought <laughs> realistic, man. That was beautiful. Mm -mm -mm. Hey, actually, it's a Formula One week again. Can you believe it? Europe. Hand ever again, Logic. Is the next big game Rick and thing, which is confusing. What? This is gameplay? Okay, it doesn't open it up in my regular browser. It opens. Why in the world? Dude, I don't understand. No, it's not. No, it's not. Is the next big game Rick Astley? No, it's not. I don't understand. Why in the world does it open it up in a. Okay, it doesn't open it up in my regular browser. It opens it up in some sort of OBS thing, which is confusing. What, this is gameplay? What, this is gameplay? Oh my god. What? Oh, it's the perspective of a body camera? It looks like VR. If it's not VR, I feel like you're gonna get very nauseous very quick, but... Yeah, we are getting to the point where video game material is pretty much indiswing uh, indistinguishable from real life. Like, you could play this on the news. And if you didn't tell me, I probably wouldn't realize that it was gameplay. Yeah, that's wild. Well, it says gameplay trailer, so... That's wild. Well, it says gameplay. Yeah, that's wild. Well, it says gameplay trailer, so I'm assuming it's real. But yeah. Unreal Five is looking really pretty. Yeah. Some people were also like, "I don't want to kill people that realistically." That is an interesting one. Yeah, I can. Interesting one. Yeah, I can. I can see that. I mean, to be fair, right, when I played a lot of Call of Duty, back in the day, I, you kind of grow a little desensitized to all of it. Then I played, like, one of the campaigns of a Call of Duty that came out, like, three, maybe four years ago or so on stream? I don't know when that was. No, I think it's less than that. Maybe two years. Anyways, um, I also had a couple moments where I was like, ooh, shit. I also had two years. I also had a couple moments where I was like, ooh, ooh shit. Like, ooh, shit. Like, ooh, shit. Ooh, this stuff's actually kind of, you know, it's actually kind of brutal. Yeah, like the airport scene and everything. That was, I think that's Modern Warfare 2, right? But anyway, anyways, um, I don't know. It is kind of cool that, it is kind of cool that uh, Unreal has gone this five, uh, this, this far though. Unreal Engine 5.2. Hi, everyone. Do we have an example? Vehicle model to sync that we're able to render in real time thanks to Nanite. Now the Rivian not only looks incredibly realistic because of Lumen and Nanite, but also its materials. And today, problem is the YouTube compression here, man. For some reason, this video is 1080p. We're introducing games definitely do become. Uh... Go ahead and add a procedure that communicates. <laughs> you may clap. You have been given permission. At this point, was painstakingly hand built by the environment team at Quixel. Everything since that fallen tree has been built using our brand new experimental suite of procedural content generation tools. Entirely an engine that are flexible, deterministic. 
The only things that are still a little unrealistic are things like faces, yeah. But that's because we are specialized in faces, right? Like, as a fellow human, I'm assuming most of you are human anyways. You're, you're very good at, you know, faces and muscles in faces and interpreting faces. Um, I'm assuming the uh, environment is probably equally unrealistic as faces, but we guys, you know, haven't specialized in it. You're at least 60% human. <laughs> You're happy if you can recognize yourself in the mirror. Okay. But yeah, it's, um, it's cool. Games are still becoming, it's cool. Games are still becoming more and more realistic for sure. One day there will be Zoomers who are like, man, screw games. I need the real nature and they go outside to forget gaming. I think those people already exist, Rumpus. I think that's probably most of the people out there. Yeah. Most people quite enjoy going out in nature. <laughs> next thing my wife- or next time my wife says I don't- Rising face- Next thing my wife- Or next time my wife says I don't understand her, I'll remind her that Loco told me I'm very good at faces. No, I'm just saying, you've been analyzing faces as a human, right? Since you were very little. So, uh, yeah, getting faces right in video games is very tricky. Plus, faces in general are very complex. But if you compare what graphics were like 10 years ago... Honestly, when I looked at games 10 years ago, I already kind of thought they looked pretty much realistic in video games. But we've gotten a whole lot better at it since then. <laughs> My hobbies include faces. Oh... oh. Oh, you're 95% human. You have a f couple of mechanical replacements for non-functioning. That's true, actually. My gehoorbeentjes. Uh, what do you call those in English? Gehoorbeentjes. Ossicles. Ossicles. Is that right? Um, anyways, the little bones inside of your ear canal, half of them, your ear canal at the end of it, that actually make you, uh, you know, hear sounds. One and a half of them, I think on the left side, got replaced with artificial ones. <laughs> okay, nerd. I actually like the Dutch bird quite a bit, man. So this gehoor literally means hearing. Beentjes literally means bones. So the Dutch word would be like, hearing bones. <laughs> a very efficient one. Oh no, this was her, this, this is like a very efficient one. Oh no, this was her, this, this is like a decade and a half ago, it's a long time ago, but yeah. No, not herring bone, not the pattern, no, no, no. Non-doctors do call them hearing bones as well. Really? Okay, so this is just uh, the doctor's term? Ah, okay. That's just a term for nerds. Term? Ah, okay. That's just a term for nerds. Can you have your hearing bones replaced in a herringbone pattern? What is the herringbone pattern again? Oh, it's that one. This is how everybody wants their floors these days, right? This is, this is, at least, this is how everybody wanted their floors, like, two year, years ago. <laughs> it's like saying gluteus maximus instead of butt. Alright, I see. I mean, I just did the Google Translate, I don't know. Do you still want this on your floor? I don't know, I don't know. Is this a still... Uh, I mean, it's, it looks good. It looks pretty good. How's my hearing changed? Oh my my hearing is not that great. I mean, my hearing changed. All my hearing is not that great. I mean, my left ear is not very good, but it's okay. <sighs> yeah, each of the three uh, hearing bones does have a specific name. Uh, hearing bones does have a specific name. No, no, that's that's no. That, that is that's a. Fair Fish. That's a herring. 
They do have bones, though. So that's like the confusing part, I guess, right? Herrings do have bones. In the Netherlands, people, people eat uh, herring oftentimes raw. Yeah, it has loads of bones raw anyways. <laughs> nice, man. Your right ear is not very good. What's going on? Blue Magikoopa. Human become a cyborg. You replaced your brain with chat GPT. Hmm. Replacing organs is gonna be hard. That's, that seems pretty... I feel like there's a... I feel like more than 50% is reasonable. 51%? Yeah, you think it's more than 50% you'll be considered a cyborg? <laughs> no. What's going on? Blue... Am I classified as a cyborg? I don't know, man. How many artificial body parts do you need for you're considered a cyborg? I mean, there's a very good chance that most of the guys in the chat, by the time they're really old, will have at least a couple artificial body parts. Be it knees, hips, whatever. I'm assuming by the time I'm 80, I can just get a new leg. <laughs> we don't do hip replacements anymore, we just get a new leg. 51%? Yeah, you think it's more than 50% you'll be considered a cyborg? I feel like more than 50% is reasonable. I feel like there's a good chance at some point people will be able to replace all their limbs. That's, that seems pretty realistic, okay? Replacing organs is gonna be hard, but I mean, we're already kind of doing that a little bit. And with we, I mean, people that are actually good at things. You have artificial corneas? Okay. 69%. Hmm. You replaced your brain with ChatGPT. We can ask ChatGPT. Does a human become a... Hello? At what point does a human... At what uh, percentage? There we go. Let's try a different topic. <laughs> Yo, hold up right now. The fuck? Right now? The fuck? The fuck? Whoa! I just get ghosted by an AI. He's like, nah, fam. <laughs> okay, okay, we'll try and get there, okay? Are you a cyborg? I asked the right questions. I'm not a cyborg. I'm a chat mode. Why do you ask? I was wondering... If I can become like you. It took a long time, dude. Yeah. I'm not sure what you mean by that. Do you want to be a chat mode of Microsoft Bing? Or do you want to have some artificial enhancements? Yes, I want to have artificial enhancements. How do I get them? I'm leading an AI right now. I'm getting to where I want to go. I gotta push him in a corner first, man. You need about four more centimeters? Fingers does seem kind of nice, blue hair. APM sh- I mean, having long fingers- I mean, having long fingers does seem kind of nice, blue hair. APM should go through the roof. <laughs> Let's see. There are different types of artificial enhancements you can get. AI-powered image enhancements, genetic engineering, brain chips, synthetic blood, gel extensions, acrylic tips. Yo, this might be something for you, uh, blue hair. You can get acrylic tips. Anyways, which can enhance the appearance. All right, that's pretty good. Make it more durable. I go for option two. Option two is about genetic engineering, which is the manipulation of DNA. All right. Gen uh, genetic engineering also raises many ethical and social questions. I know. My God. I'm a Zoomer. I can't read that much. Please shorten that. <laughs> I'm not actually a Zoomer. It's okay. This very complex AI. 
just I'm not actually a zoomer. It's okay. This very complex AI just summarized incredibly complex subjects in like two paragraphs. Option two can change your DNA to make it better. It can be good or bad for you and others. You need to think carefully and ask an expert before doing it. Wait, I can do it? Yeah, I don't think it's... Yeah, exactly. This is... This is not... I'm not a cyborg if I'm genetically enhanced. You can't do it yourself. You need a professional. You need to be sure that it's safe, legal, and ethical. It's not something you can just decide on a whim. Okay, thanks, mom. Thanks. <sighs> Thanks. <sighs> yeah, it's asking me about ethics, which is kind of ironic. We'll discuss. Yeah, it's ask asking me about ethics, which is kind of ironic coming from an AI. <laughs> Generally, uh, a little eth. Yeah. So the ethics you need to, for example, discuss, right? Say, for example, I can grow a third arm. I can just, like, one day wake up and, like, attach a third arm right over here to the middle of my chest. Very helpful when eating spaghetti on the couch. Because I can just, you know, eat it without spilling it all over myself. But, what about playing StarCraft 2? If I have three hands, is it ethically moral for, for me to play StarCraft 2? Or am I just an enhanced athlete? Uh, I don't know. Do you think you need more than two hands to eat spaghetti without making a miss? Absolutely. Three hands would make eating spaghetti much easier on the couch. Zeus! Four years! Hell yeah. Look, if you had a third hand, would it be a right hand, a left hand? Ooh. Couch. Look, if you had a third hand, would it be a right hand, a left hand? Ooh. I would want to have the thumb on top. So it's my middle hand. Or thumbless. I guess I'm okay with thumbless. Two opposable thumbs. Does anybody really need three opposable thumbs? Or I could have a hand with just thumbs. <laughs> I could just have one hand. Or like a thumb on either side. There's a lot of options I haven't really considered yet, man. I'll get back to you on that one. Six opposable thumbs on one hand does sound kind of freaky, though. Basically a crap. Anyways, I don't think I'm a cyborg yet. Just because I had some of my hearing bones replaced. When I was a kid. That's the ultimate question we were trying to find answers for. You may have forgotten it, but... No, no, I can't hear it worse than a regular human. It'd be kind of sick if I could get him replaced and hear better than the average human, though. But I guess that's all handled by the brain. We're not very good at replacing brain. No, Brenda! Brenda, no! You monster! Game. Okay, this is the last game I'm playing. Too many. To contest with his huge army. Too much eco where we don't use dead languages. <laughs> or introverted. Can't tell, LRS. Hmm. Yeah, man. Potato mash it. Play. Pull. I need like I can do if I go twelve pool. <laughs> He's going mech on the back of it. <laughs> oh, he's oh, he sacked his own reaper. <laughs> This guy's a maniac, dude! He got it, though. 
<laughs> He's going mech. I don't really know if that trade. That game didn't give you the opportunity. Okay. A, a cannon rush. I don't think so. Hey, thank you for. Are you kidding me, Loki? If I did go for a 12 pool, though, you probably. Months? I appreciate you. Months? Oh. Ah, the page. That was too much. Oh, okay. Here's the thing. It's the spot right over there. Boom! Oh, it was the spot. I'm so it would have been even. The same time, though, I've done a lot of damage to him. This is it. This is the spot right over there. Boom! Oh, it was the spot. I'm so good at the game. I mean, you know, would have been even better if I killed something, I suppose. No, I'm gonna go. Lows, low, slow. Oh, that was uh, that was something. That, that yeah, you know what? I can confirm that that was something. Well, God, that was some good casting you did together with Piglo Pog. Also, thank you, Eliminator. Also for the compliment. Thank you, Sport, for the sixty-nine month resub. I appreciate you. Um. I mean, this game didn't look good, but he lost so many meta effects, though. Like, that game kind of felt like it was over, but that's because you kind of make the assumption that meta effects and marines are free, right? As a Zerk player, for fellow Zerk players out there, think. Meta effects and the marines, and to a further extent, even zealot run bys, they do cost resources. Zealot run bys are not free. Marine drops cost money. What? I know, I know. This is insane. I think what this guy did is basically lose all of his Metavex for... Like, la 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 la, I'm not listening. <laughs> I'm fairly sure what happened in this game is that uh, my Terran opponent, if it would have microed his Metavex a bit better, he would have been okay. And he dropped me all over the map, but like... Yeah, this was not a bad start for me. Yeah, this was also not a bad start for me. Yeah, that actually helped out a lot. Yeah, so he killed a lot of drones, he did a lot of damage, and I derped pretty hard. Oh yeah, I lost my natural too, that was pretty dumb. How, uh, so how did I lose my natural again? I don't quite get it. So these guys have guns? They shoot gun buildings? Units over here though. Oh, okay, well I did. There's <laughs> three roaches, that's pretty good. Yeah, I had two to five spores per base, man. I'm surprised my base died. Because I did send units there, but I guess I didn't send enough. Yeah, but even at this point, I'm still fine, though. He's only at 44. Man with gun is OP, dude. Like, my, my roach is specced into acid. Now, th throwing acid at one another is kind of OP. But... I don't know. Yeah, so basically, all this time, right? Four meta effects, 60 marines have gone down. Yeah, so they're actually kind of pricey. So I did lose more than him, but I was also mining way more. This fight felt a bit funky, but I figured it was okay. Yeah, okay. Loco, if you want to check out this trailer, it looks like the next big game. I haven't clicked the link yet. My next big game, I don't understand. Why in the world does it open? All jokes aside, no. Like what a Greek god looks like. I mean, even the first person. So, person, you're white. What's that? That crew? Human? Try. By water, they mean so and sport. That is. uh 
actually, hang on, hang on. Clem's grenades might have. Oh, I have chaotic ending to a game in the EPT North America. Oh, I have these. Gun. Oh, he's got the better concave, better grenades as well. Actually, those were really, really good grenades. America. Oh, I have these. Gun. Oh, he's got the better concave. Back I have end. to replace. Oh my goodness! The two grenades at the end turned the. <laughs> Cute little engagement right there. I saw that one actually. I did see it. Um, it was actually pretty funny. Welcome, all colors, all sexes, or love lives here. That's beautiful, man. Welcome all colors, all sexes, all orientations, all religions, all cultures, all abilities, all ages, all sizes, except the Danish. Love lives here. That's beautiful, man. That is, uh... This is probably somewhere in Sweden or Norway or something. Yeah. I'm not exactly miss with people. Yeah. I'm not exactly sure what the problem is with people from Denmark. Or in Denmark with people from Sweden. Or in Sweden with people from Norway. Norway or in Norway with people from De I'm not sure I don't quite understand what's happening there but it's okay I thought Denmark was the happiest place to live yeah, yeah yeah Denmark is considered to be the happiest country overall the thing is though they tried to quantify happiness now they did come up with some metrics I actually got a book I bought a book specifically on Denmark and happiness yeah, so like you have, but you have to quantify happiness. What, what does that mean? How do you attach a number to happiness? Anyways, all that really mattered though in those lists of happiness is that the Netherlands ranked higher than Belgium. So that's pretty good. My, my English book? I don't want to tilt my head, dude. This seems like a lot of effort. When Loco starts stealth games, how Loco finishes stealth games? <laughs> You're not wrong, dude. I lose patience at some point, okay? Patience at some point. I lose patience at some point, okay? It's officially my five year and okay. Thank you very much, Snuck the Five years, man! Lovely Dutch Saturday evening. This is what are they doing? It's so pointless. I mean, uh, paper when we both have 10 million, and then we're going on a tour, right? Around the world, create drone up or sorry, uh, get all having two anti air in each base. He memed about that, and Twitch chat basically meme orders tournament, Alec Dar. No, it's a it's a meme from the gamers. That's tape. Your move, Jagex. Chat G. I saw a great video on bots in RuneScape. Well, I saw part of it. Uh, Chat GPT is about to destroy RuneScape. Your move, Jagex. Okay, okay, yeah, we all get what Chat GPT is, right? about accounts having in the last week. So so basically basically bots in RuneScape they've always been a thing, right? Very commonly do you see bots in MMORPGs. But apparently now bots are starting to have full on conversations using those algorithms. Started doing some research and got in touch with someone who not only knew the answer but was willing to show me. So I went to meet up with an account of his in Lumbridge Graveyard. Everything you see this account type is generated by a large language model called ChatGPT 3.5. I'm sure you've all heard of it by now. I asked what it likes about RuneScape. It says the grind and sense of accomplishment and leveling up skills and completing, but gets cut off. I think completing quests. And then I asked what it doesn't like about RuneScape. It says combat RNG hits not based on skill, bots ruining the economy, and unbalanced <laughs> PPT. I love the fact that a bot answers that it thinks bots are ruining the economy. That's so funny. And then a random player joins in the conversation and says, hey, what's up? Notice this doesn't mess up the bot, meaning it can hold a conversation while other players talk around 
found it. Then I ask if the bot hates RuneScape bots. It says, yeah, hate bots, ruins the grind and devalues items. I ask who its favorite RuneScape player is. It says, I don't know to be honest, I usually solo and don't talk much, but I respect Wooks' skills. Then I push further and actually ask it who is Wooks and who is Bodhi. And it gives a very accurate description of both people. <laughs> then I ask what it thinks of Sir Pugger, and that's when things get creepy. I think that's this guy's channel. Yeah, Sir Pugger is he. Very quickly. Sick, sick content. I love you, Sir Pugger. Okay, okay, hold up. It responded, sick, sick content. I love you, Sir Pugger. But that implies it knows I'm Sir Pugger, which it wouldn't. It doesn't intake usernames. So I thought the guy running the bot was messing with me, but he literally immediately sent me the entire chat log from the site that connects to ChatGPT's API that he's using. And it, it was the bot. That's creepy good. I would never suspect that was a bot. And the more I learned, the worse it got. The person showed me the prompt being used. In other words, the context botters are feeding chat GPT to use to respond, which is respond in less than 70 characters as an average OSRs player without being too chatty and do not mention OpenAI or chat GPT and do not use proper grammar. Now this prompt is super important because it's totally customizable. Each botter can edit it for each bot or each bot farm. Meaning each bot or bot farm can have different responses and personalities. It can be edited so that the bot specifically responds about what it's doing. For example, you know, it's running a phishing script. It can here's the real kicker. I've been thinking about this. You can literally have video games, especially MMORPGs that are filled with people that you wouldn't be able to distinguish from people. Like they would, you could literally have MMORPGs that currently don't have a high population at all and have intelligent conversations with them. Yeah, you can quite literally run dungeons in, I don't know, World of Warcraft, for example, with bots rather than humans. And you know what? They would probably do a better job. Told to respond like it's a RuneScape player board of fish. He told the job told to respond like it's a runescape player bored of fishing or it could respond like a grumpy player who's angry at jagex whatever it is so the real question is is chat gpt 3.5 already good enough to trick players and if so what are the implications so i found a couple other people using bots hooked up to chat gpt to find out which we'll get into right after this listen up this sponsor so, is pretty I, I guess you can have like a full-on conversation so Life isn't good. Constant. Oh, yeah, yeah, hold up. Male voice and the screen goes red when the bot's talking. Life isn't good. Constant deaths. No luck. So this is the bot. Broke. I don't want a kid anymore. Not interested in raising a child. <laughs> Iron Man sucks. Iron Man is bad. WTF is the point. Why even bother? But they have cool things next to their name. What cool things do they have next to their name? <laughs> I don't know. I guess I hate myself lol. Feeling depressed about my progress in the game. Same. So there's people out there that are having full conversations while fishing in RuneScape with bots, and they can't tell that they're having with bots. There could be bots talking to bots. There's no way of not knowing. You could have literal conversations between bots, and it makes the world feel like it's alive. So, so far the bot seems very agreeable and rephrases a lot of what is said, but even that seemed to trick all the players around it. And here's more footage I was sent. This time, the context prompt Respond as a grumpy player. be a grumpy RuneScape player. Combat stats, bud. What's the point? 77 mage, 53 defense. Why you no have 99 mage yet shake my head. I started a month ago and wanted to fish, mine, smith, and craft. You start game, you PVM -er noob, you don't know how to play. Very nice. Level crafting. Why you no level up crafting faster? Shake my head. Smithing level, please. Level mining. Get lost, noob. Go mine yourself. You start an ultimate Iron Man and get to 30 smithing. I dare you. No, thank you. Waste of time. So why are you complaining? Stop wasting my time with useless questions. Definitely going on the bad list. You are playing RuneScape. Where is there use in any of this? No point to this. Waste of time. Right. <laughs> Bot name, I liked you. Don't annoy me, so I ignore you. Quit whining and play the game. Not only did none of the players in the conversation get suspicious, but the bot literally roasted the players and argued with them for a good three minutes without raising suspicion. And this isn't even ChatGPT4, which is supposed to be leaps ahead of this 3.5 model. Honestly, it's kind of hard to believe this is a bot, but if you've used ChatGPT, you probably believe it. And everyone who sent me footage 
also sent me logs of these conversations. What are the implications of all of this? Now that you all know- You could literally have full on MMORPG worlds though, full of players that you can't distinguish from actual players. Which is, hmm. I'm sure, pretty sure people got sus. Extra models aren't got get, like obviously they're gonna get worse. They're gonna get better. This is out there implanted in RuneScape bots. You could watch out for. Unfortunately, the bots will soon be hooked up to Chat GPT four, and then eventually a Chat GPT five or six. As the war between Jagex and the botters escalates, if Jagex's detection gets better, <laughs> it's only natural to think. It is really kind of an idea that's interesting, but also a bit scary. Yeah. How does ChatGPT play the game? No? It's to hide bots, right? Like, people can obviously report if they suspect that you're a bot. But if they're having a conversation, like, basically the way people determine whether or not they're talking to, uh, or, or they're, you know, playing with a bot is by looking at their nickname and their behaviors in general. But bots up to this point haven't talked back. I'm not sure, man. Yeah, yeah, so it's a bot mixed in with a chat GPT bot. I don't, I don't really talk in RuneScape ever, no. I play RuneScape and I never have a conversation with back. I don't, I don't really, really talk in RuneScape ever, no. I, maybe private messages, but... It's just, uh, it's just kind of an interesting idea. Maybe I'm a bot, man, yeah. You okay, buddy? Making noises. It's really hard, okay. <sighs> to hatch first. Uh, I don't want to make any calls, man, but... Uh, more MMR sounds shaky, but I also like queuing. This is actually... Uh, this is actually pretty clever. You know, the Afrika at the same time. Don't know why they start to be quite reasonable. I think a lot of people support people. But I, the richest man in the world? Oh, this over here. Elon Musk revealed, actually, though. When the NFL are doing fine. One, one. Elon Musk revealed he's making $120,000 a month in Twitter subscription revenue, according to this screenshot. Oh, this over here. Wait, people are subscribing to Elon Musk on Twitter and give him five bucks a month? I mean, you know what? As a streamer, I understand people paying, you know, a subscription. And it's really cool, actually, because you subscription at a monthly fee. I get that, right? I think it's really cool, actually, because you can support people. But I, the richest man in the world? Or however rich the guy is right now? 24.7k. So he himself is... Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a month smile low. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get bonus content. <laughs> God. You think Elon could even notice if it's, if it's 120,000 more? Or less every month. I'm not sure how... I don't know how these guys pay them. So I don't know how it works at this level. I feel like he doesn't notice it. Anyways, thank you very much, Gregory. For the 38-month resub. I appreciate you. So you need 136 million followers. For... That's, that's a lot of followers, guys. Yeah, I remember that, Mathanas. That was a couple years ago. That they really wanted one of those uh, Kardashian girls to be the world's youngest self-made billionaire. So people started donating. A lot of money to her so she could be the low. <laughs> it's so fucking dumb. Anyway. So fucking dumb. Oh, f***ing dumb.
Anyways. Loco pretending not to be a billionaire? No, no, no. I'm definitely uh, a multi-billionaire, of course, but... <sighs> Anyways, guys. I'm gonna go and play two... Like, if it wasn't for those two 12 pools... Anybody do that? Your application... Yeah, I submitted an application. But, like, why would anybody... Why would... Any According to Twitter, you would make Doki Doki Literature Club? No, According to Twitter, you would make $6 a month? Why would anybody... No, I don't know. We're gonna play some... According to Twitter, you would make $6 a month? Why would anybody subscribe to my Twitter? I believe if I have that thing enabled right now as well that allows me to monetize my Twitter or some shit so people can subscribe to my Twitter or some shit so people can subscribe to my monetize my Twitter or some shit or some shit or some shit So people can so people can subscribe to my Twitter. But like why would anybody do that? Yeah, yeah. I submitted an application. Your application has been submitted. Why would anybody do that? I'm not sure. This becomes a like I think they assumed like one in ten of your followers becomes a paying subscriber or some shit. Subscriber or some shit. or some because it suggested that I could make up to X amount of dollars a month. And it seemed to me that they assumed that like a thousand of my followers or so decide to subscribe to my Twitter. There's no way. Please don't subscribe to my Twitter. That'd be weird. Maybe, I don't know. You could if you really want to, if you really feel like it, but free money though, Loco. It could become a meme, right? You never know. Yeah, it could definitely be become a meme. I don't use Twitter. It feels like political discussions on family meetings. I think Twitter is fun if you curate your timeline reasonably. You gotta kind of like you first off. You never use this tab, okay? The for you tab is is terrible. Don't use that one. Use use this one instead, right? And then you only follow people that you actually want to watch. And something that you also should definitely do is mute everybody you don't want to hear. So I've got a load of people muted on Twitter. Uh, which is really nice. Highly recommend it. <laughs> Muting is... Um, you can even ban... It's kind of mandatory. You can even ban certain words too. So say like you don't want to hear anybody using the word Trump. Right? Which, you know, I guess is a, a verb. But, but anyways, not really used in that way anymore. Uh, you could just, you know, ban the entire word. Which is kind of nice. Yeah. But if you just kind of let... You just kind of let... But if you just kind of let Twitter do its own thing, right? You just kind of let Twitter just do its own shit. Is do its own shit. You just kind of let Twitter just do its own shit. Just do its own shit. Is going to be a disaster. You muted the word Fortnite? <laughs> You muted the word StarCraft? Okay. I always question, should I log into Twitter and then two-factor authentic uh, authentication comes up and I'm too lazy to continue? Fair enough. Maybe you can just mute the letter E. Any tweet with the letter E will just disappear. That sounds kind of fun. You would log into Twitter if they actually gave you your account back? Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna play a little bit of... St oh, no, wrong button. Ha! That's honestly a good I don't remember what I was doing Because it's been a full week But I remember I have survived the winter And that's all All that really matters Hi Loka, thanks for your help with the fish Nature Hey Yes And I told Loran about the polygamy mod in this game Figured out. Now we're gonna have to get goats, I guess. You know what's really messed up, guys? I told Loran about the polygamy mod in this game. And literally, 
Two hours later, she mentioned she was thinking about starting up a new playthrough of Stardew herself as well. Anyways. Mm -mm -mm. I'm making it a little more Okay, I'm making it a little more dramatic than it is, guys. Let's see. Um, so I've got some- I wanna plant some of the- Oh, I also got the apple- uh, the polygamy mod basically allows you to marry everybody. Once. Simultaneously. Even the wizard? I guess. I've never played with it, but... As far as gameplay goes, it sounds kind of fun. As far as real life goes, it sounds horrible. But hey. <laughs> it is kind of fun. fun that somebody has made a mod for that. You can marry Linus? Oh yeah, absolutely. Um, I need to go drop these off in the computer. I have some seats. Yeah, I have some cauliflower. Um, I'm gonna need... So I've got these two, the right Get the greenhouse here, barn. No matter which one, I don't think, but I need to get all the crops. This talk of automating the relationship for your spouse is overkill, dude. Any talk of automating the relationship, that's a good line to say again. So I need 25 and oh, with me. Secondly, flowers are fucking expensive. Twitch subs, you could frequently, but then ooh, you get a tier three sub for your wife. Nice try! I found her alternate ID chat, I figured it out! I already got a gift, I already got something. I could get her a microwave? What'd you get, Loco? Nice try. Get her a sub on your channel? Getting her a gift at this point has become difficult, guys. Mm -mm -mm. Then you have to think of thoughtful thing about it. It's almost like My blobfish really like that. When it comes to religious flippert, when it comes to religious Your mom gets a bouquet every month, or er, every week? For your shrine? For your shrine? I'm not an expert when it comes to religious flowers. It'd be a surprise. There you go. My blobfish. Then you have to think of thoughtful ultimate. Getting her a gift at this point has become difficult, guys. Yeah, absolutely. Getting her a gift at this point has become difficult, guys. It's been too long. Get her a sub on your channel. Ooh. That is a truly loving gift. No, I already got a gift. I already got something. I could get her a microwave? Ooh. That's love. What did you get, Loco? Nice try. Nice try! I found her alternate ID chat, I figured it out! I was gonna get her tickets to this musical thing, but then she bought it herself and she's like, Hey, I got, got us tickets for this musical thing. I was like, okay, great! That was literally my one and only plan. I finally came up with something in advance. I was really proud of myself too, man. Like, I actually came up with an idea by myself. We're actually going tomorrow. Her birthday isn't for another couple weeks, but we're actually going to see this musical tomorrow. Self. We're actually going tomorrow. Her birthday isn't for another couple weeks. Should be kind of fun. For our anniversary this year, we're going to the ballet. Someone shoot me. Lauren wanted to go see this, bu this ballet as well. Um, we, we, we went to go see it last year. I felt very out of place. Uh, but she really wanted to go, so I was like, okay, fine. Um, Zwanemir is what it's called in Dutch? It was really fucking expensive too, man. I had no idea. It was really f fucking ex fucking ex expensive. Expensive. Fucking ex expensive. It was really expensive too, man. I had no idea. Well, I mean, I think it was like 60 bucks for one ticket. Zvanamir. Uh, what's the English name? Swan Lake? 
Is that the English name? Does this say anything to anybody? Anyways, um, we found out neither of us liked it. <laughs> but at least now we know. <laughs> there were a lot of guys in very tight pants in that, in that show, dude. It was, uh... They were, they were having a good time. Me, not so much. For Mother's Day, I'm buying my wife binoculars so she can watch the birds outside our house. I'm either amazed or horrible at getting gifts. I think that's pretty good. Although that does sound like a gift that, you know, you will use more than your wife. You know, I don't know, I don't know your wife. Um, but there is a chance that that is one of those gifts that you're accidentally buying for yourself. Even though that wasn't the intention. <laughs> okay, she loves looking at birds. Okay, okay, fair. No, I don't know his wife. No, I don't know his wife, believe it or not. I know I'm a guy in the chat, but still. You're getting binoculars that are way too nice. <laughs> you fucking wanted to buy your wife a fucking You You fucking wanted to you wanted to buy your wife a nice gift and suddenly you find yourself on the binocular subreddit you look at there frequently ask questions and you have a top five list and the cheapest one starts at 399 is this what happened because that would happen to me every fucking time i try to me every fucking time time I try and think of anything like okay well this is definitely not what I needed I saw some of Amazon that were like 30 bucks and now I'm considering that they're actually trash <laughs> your girlfriend wants a 4080 that's a good gift that's a real good gift man top five flower recommendations oh god Amazon gift card problem solved? No, 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 no. Amazon gift card is not problem solved, man. It's problem delayed. That is a problem all on its own, man. <laughs> See, I would appreciate an Amazon gift card. That sounds pretty great. But that's also... <laughs> that, that could also be an issue. Um, I was gonna do something. Right. Surprise, honey, it's your birthday. Going to bed, 640. Surprise, honey, it's your birthday. And Surprise, an issue. Surprise, honey, it's your birthday. An Amazon gift card. I don't know, man. The best gift I received was a mug my boyfriend made when we were at college. That sounds really sweet. Lemonade here with the perfect relationship. Ew. Gross. Self-made gift. I'm really craving a fresh apricot. Okay. Gift. Cave. That's a very good point. Do bombs this takes a my upgraded bomb. I get it. I think you probably shouldn't. <laughs> Bunny. Have you ever played RuneScape, Bunny? Uh, this is definitely done. You gotta. Mm. Quite bigly. Got these. Catch the legendary springfish. At the beginning of day eight, I. Go. Um. I got a letter in the mail from Penny, saying that I needed to meet her at the bathhouse. This was a trial run, it doesn't count. Um, at the bathhouse, past, or in the evening, past, past sundown or whatever. Thought you did, but I wasn't sure. I Yo, caught life. So currently my fishing's level 8. Oh, we're getting close to Mexico. Okay guys, it's almost time for our date. At the beginning of day eight, I got a letter in the mail from Leia. Or, what's her name? Penny. Fuck. Eight, I got a letter in the mail from Leia.
Or, what's her name? Penny. Fuck. I got my girlfriend's name wrong. I got my girlfriend's name wrong. Um, <clears throat> okay, well, at least we practiced it before the date began. <clears throat> okay, well, at least we practiced it before, before the date began. Um, I got a letter in the mail from Penny saying that I need, needed to meet her at the ba This was a trial run, I don't care. Um, uh, at the bathhouse. Past, or in the evening. Past, past sundown or whatever is what it said. Happens to the best of us. I don't recommend doing that in real life, though. It's a bad idea. Okay, well, I think the sun's pretty far down right now, 6.30 p.m. 6.30 p.m. That could have gotten real awkward, but... <clears throat> okay, I've been working all day, I smell of horse. What a perfect day. Um... Oh, dude, this is kind of smart, before my, uh, before my day, I'm gonna uh, lift some weights, you know? Makes my biceps and my chest look huge. You're too weak to lift it? Yo, what the fuck? Lift it? Yo, what the fuck? Lift it? Yo, what the fuck? Okay, fine. There I am, man. Oh god. Chat, look away. There you are. I was worried you didn't get my note. What is this? This is certainly new. I have not seen this before. It looks like we're alone. Yes, Petty. Yes. The water feels so good after being out in the cold of night, doesn't it? Why I asked you to here tonight. <clears throat> You have something to tell me? I'm not exactly sure. You wanted to see me in my bathing suit. <laughs> Why are you guys all posting threes in the chat? What's up with that, guys? Okay, fine. No! Okay, fine. No! How do I say this? Oh, God. This is every guy's worst nightmare. We may have completely wrong. Wrong? Oh god. God, we fucked it up, man. God, we fucked Oh god, we f fucked it up. It up, man. It up, man. How do I say this? Oh shit, dude. Oh shit. How do I say this? Oh shit. Dude, I've been meaning to tell you for a while about you. Oh god, I just got friend zoned. I think I can't stop thinking about. Oh shit, we did it! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, shit! We did it! I've never felt this way about anyone. Of all the diamonds. Sorry, but I. <laughs> okay, fine. Oh, Loco, I thought you did, but I wasn't sure. I'll always remember this night. Yo, caught live on camera, man. Now we're married, no? That's how that works. That was the end of the scene? We didn't get to see what happened after that? Well then. Loco, you dog. I'm just... Saying it's two hours later right now, guys. That's all I'm saying. I'm gonna get banned on Twitch for a week. That'd be well worth it. Each. Yeah. Did you really start? Very cool. This is the first thing I see. Yeah, okay. Buying fucking anime. I think it's kind of fun to own the. Like, if you 
online for me, sort of like a PDF? Yeah, I bring up anime and suddenly all- If you say you're reading anime, how do you read anime? Gojo Saturo is back? Yo, man, that's hype. If you say you're reading anime, how do you read anime? Do you get the actual books? Or do you get like a PDF? Or is it like a, a Kindle? Or like, how do people read anime in 2023? Or sorry, manga. 5 IQ. PDF? <laughs> yeah! I bring up anime and suddenly all the moderators are here? God. It's a very, very odd. Moderators are weeps, man. <laughs> Front rush. <laughs> Good point. Line for me, sort of like a PDF? I see. I feel like it's kind of fun to own the... Like, if you're gonna read manga, isn't it kind of fun to own the manga actual books type of things? Or how does that even work? I'm assuming you can buy them quite easily, although, I don't know, I found out that buying fucking anime shows that the buy buying f fucking... Buying f anime shows is difficult. It's too many volumes? Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, so it becomes a collecting kind of thing. Okay, I see. Manga collection. There's probably a subreddit for this. Yep, slash r slash manga collectors. This is the first thing I see. This is the first collectors. This is the first thing I see. Okay, um, let's go to top rated of all time. I see. You need a whole, you need, dude, this is huge. Big in my home. Huge. You need your house, to, dude. I don't even have a room that big in my home. The manga usually differ from the show, and each volume is about 10. And if you don't have a publisher that does regular printing, it's really difficult to get manga out of Japan. I see. I see. Dude, it's 20 photos. This guy is a kitchen island for, for manga. So, how much is one book? Like, roughly. How much is, like, a regular price for one volume, I guess is what you would call it? For Attack on Titan. Like, ten bucks? Ten bucks? Okay. Yeah, this guy has accidentally become... He's, he's accidentally made his own library. This is kind of cool, though. See, I'm kind of scared of going down the rabbit hole. Wow, look at this. Eleven months. Almost a whole year. Like, I'm afraid I would like it, you know? <laughs> Rule one? What's rule one? Anti and suggestive content are to be marked as not suitable for work. Fair enough. Hey, thank you very much, Raiden. For the 11. Ooh, dude, that is hype. Look at that. See, that is cool. I like that a lot. I have no idea what, what this is. But that's like a fucking art piece now. Yeah. This you could actually put in your living room, and people wouldn't be, you know, thinking you're too weird. Maybe this is. But that's like a fucking art piece. That's like a fucking art piece. Like a fucking art piece. That's like a fucking art piece. Yeah. This you could actually put in your living room, and people wouldn't be, you know, thinking you're too weird. Maybe a little bit, but... What's up, Papuch? That's the first season of Naruto? Oh, it's the first season. Oh, shit. It's not the whole thing. Shit. It's not the whole... It's the first... Oh, that's the first season of Naruto? Oh, it's the first season. Oh, shit. It's not the whole thing. Oh, there's a little cat. That's not fair, man. My wife and I have finally moved our 2500 volumes to a dedicated manga room. Dude, that is genuinely kind of sick. The thing is, though, the only way you can have a room like this is if your wife or your partner in general is on board. 
Like, imagine having limited space in your place, right? Which I guess is the case for 99.9% .9 of people. And you have one room dedicated just for your manga. Yeah, the term manga room kind of irks me a little bit. She doesn't need to know. All right, then. You have, like, a secret room behind a fucking, I don't know, room behind a fucking... Room behind a, I don't know, staircase. If done well, though, this shit looks really cool. Yeah, this guy's run out. Of yeah, this guy's run out of space, though, because he's also double layering. Double layering a bouquet sucks, because then you can't find anything. Yeah. Okay. So wait, one of those, one of those, one of those books is roughly 10 bucks? That's surprisingly reasonable, though. Am I wrong? That doesn't sound too bad. These are sealed, by the way. <laughs> Guy walked into class today, gave me all the Helsing for free. Because we talk about manga every day in class together. Yo, I don't wanna, I don't wanna, I, I know exactly what this is, uh, you know. Alright, I see where this goes. Yeah, no, I see, I get it. Ooh. Okay, that's actually kind of neat. Yeah, it's like a bookshop. I've always kind of liked that, though, in general. I think it looks good, but like, the thing is, then you have to, you know... The problem with like having a lot of books, right, like physical copies, is that you rarely reread a book. Like, there will be some books you'll reread, I guess. But for most of the... at least most books I've ever read, I just kind of have them, and then I keep them around, even though I plan on doing absolutely nothing with them in the future. So you can just kind of keep them for the collection, but... Yeah, yeah they get dusty too. Yeah. Wait, what's that, Pupuch? You mean the thing from like a week ago? Yeah, exactly. It's the same with movies. And stuff. Yeah, my Twilight collection is of course falling apart. I switched to a Kindle, like Twitch chats. And but there's a lot of people that swear by having physical books, you know. And I get it. So the reason 10 US dollars is pretty expensive for a manga is that in Japan, even when translated are between 2.50 USD 5... Oh, I thought it was a pretty... That's so fucking... I don't understand. I can... Normally, so I don't know. I'm not exactly sure what this plan is. Anyways. Grimdy in charge of the V Rising server. Yeah, I would want to set up a V Rising server again. I it's Britain's antitrust watchdog. If I'm doing if market to drive in a going <laughs> everybody's just fucking old over here, man. Dude, on point. Boomers, dude. Do you guys use cloud gaming? Any? Yeah, but twenty million. I'm sure, what he's up to? Sentries. Don't tell me the sentries. Far today, I. And then it's just twice the. Ooh. Then why do you have books? Okay. Mechanical keyboards are worth five hundred dollars because they will last a lifetime. Then why do you have more than one? Yeah, <laughs> keyboard is not one to school. Yeah, Take a mechanical. Key it is normal. I haven't been here for a while. Let's see. Mechanical keyboards are worth five hundred. I haven't been here for a while. Let's see. Mechanical keyboards are worth five hundred dollars because they will last a lifetime. Then why do you have more than one? Yeah, <laughs> a good point. 
Yeah, keyboard guys in the chat. They're supposed to, uh, you know, if they're supposed to outlast you. Then why do you have multiples? Yeah, building your own keyboard. Dude, they're not really even... They're not even really sharing pictures of keyboards. What's going on? I expected pictures of keyboards. What is this? Who takes a photo like this? This guy's just showing off his lower arm veins. What, what's going on here? Is this how you normally take a picture of a keyboard? Is this normally done in the... Yeah? The Giga Chats of the gaming community, dude. <laughs> they sit in the sauna for 20 minutes, do a couple of bicep curls, and then they take a photo. <laughs> that keyboard's like 40 pounds. I see how it is. A little, little bit of forearm flex going on. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Pretty slash R slash custom keyboards is better. Custom key... Let's see. Oh, this is... Okay, actual pictures of custom keyboards? This is the first thing I see. Oh no. Okay, fine. Top. All time. Okay, we get actual pictures of key- Oh god, okay. He included a booty shot? Jesus. He included a booty shot? Jesus. Damn, that's kinda hot. Um, okay. That's a lot of keyboards, man. So what's the difference from keyboard to keyboard? Are, do you think they're mostly different switches? I guess they probably are all different switches and they probably feel slightly different. The colors are different? Really? The perfect keyboard for Among Us? The perfect keyboard for Among Us? Ooh. Why does it look tiny? What's going on here? That's kind of cute. That is kind of... This is a Protoss player keyboard right here, man. That's all you need. Honestly, it's too big. They could cut off the right half. He has one through six. Nobody uses... No, There's no Protoss out there using more than six, six buttons for, for control groups. He doesn't need... Oh, yeah, there's no F2 button. That's a good point. No F2 button. Hmm. No numpad? <laughs> These guys are way beyond the no numpad crowd, okay? I am also a strong believer in no numpad usage. These guys are, are way stronger believers of that. Numpad is, uh... What is up with this? I have seen this in photos before. I mean the collect- or the connector. Why is the connector like this? Is it just so you can, like... Unscrew it and plug in another keyboard without doing the whole cable. Is that the only reason? It's a quick disconnect to change keyboards faster. Okay, because I was I was wondering about that man It kind of reminds me of like a, a electric guitar amp a quick swap I, I assume these are gonna be kind of expensive fair Ooh, A Pokemon one I feel like this looks really cool until you're actually trying to play a game and then you constantly blind yourself with your LEDs. Yeah, building your own keyboard is actually expensive, man. Ooh, there it is. The sophisticated gamer. If you have ever girl over on a first date or whatever, this, this is what does it, man. Girls love guys that have their mechanical keyboard. With little plants uh, hung up on the the wall. Yeah, yeah. This is this is this is where it happens. No numpad on any of those. No numpads, dude. They'll probably have separate numpads. If they have girls over, I hide my anime collectibles. Do you really, Sergeant Yoda? That's amazing. This is for the real, the real numpad connoisseurs. Like, separate numpads. This is when you know you're a hardcore numpad user. Yeah. <laughs> when I have girls over, I hide my anime collectibles. That's fantastic. Are we throwing shade at numpad users? No, no, no. I'm not a numpad user. 
I understand that some people like to play games like this with their eyes or their arms tilted outwards like that, you know? Are we throwing shade at Fantastic. Are we throwing shade at numpad users? No, no, no. I'm not a numpad user myself, but I understand that some people like to play games like this with their eyes or their arms tilted outwards like that, you know? I, I prefer having my wrist in line with my, with my arms, but you know. Numpad users like it, like, it's okay. I'm not throwing shade. <laughs> You're doing push-ups. <laughs> you, you use your mouse and keyboard like this. That's amazing. You don't have a standing desk. You just have it up to your armpits. <laughs> That's smart. Pad very overrated. I find numpad very overrated, yeah. Yoga for the wrists? Oh, okay. Yo, family friendly show, okay? Oh, okay. You wanna cancel me for not being a numpad user? That sounds like a wall cancel, to be honest. Warcraft 2 ladder games using only numpad? Uh, numpads are... Yeah, I, I don't know. I, I'm not usually a fan, but... Then again, I don't have a real job. I have a fake job. You got your wrist injured? I hope you keep saying that his wrist is the only one that like... <clears throat> Bain speed. I'll go double expo. So one of them is mostly just a macro hatchery, but... Okay, I'm still great. Switch. That looked a little. I should have knocked down those rocks. Over there. About uh, a dozen. I was gonna go. To go in there, but I felt like I had enough stuff there. Thank you, Mr. Jern. I felt like I had enough stuff there. Can I send you the picture tomorrow? I don't think it's my birthday. But uh, I guess. Uh, uh, home story cups are so. Uh, home story cups are so much fun. No, he posted. Oh, I remember this photo. He posted. But uh, I guess uh, threatening the the crown princess recently. Uh, I guess. Uh, oh, I remember this photo. He posted a photo on the Discord server. Man, look at look at. <laughs> wow, wow! I almost looked at the camera. Very nice. Four out of ten. Almost saw the camera lens. That's awesome, man. Uh, home story cups are so much fun. Loco looks very stoned. No, no, definitely. <clears throat> That's from home story cup? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can even see Dennis in the background. Take himself. This is the kitchen right over here. This is usually where the set is. So right behind this pillar is usually where like the, the stream recording is. Who's the guy sitting on the floor? I don't know. <laughs> this is just the guy sitting on the floor. The pizza is met over here. This is where the the kitchen area is. Home story cups actually a lot of fun. I hope they're gonna do one when you play against. I hope they're gonna do another one. Home story cups actually a lot of fun. Area is. Home story cups actually when you play against. <laughs> When you play against Protoss on the ladder. 
is so stupid, man. What's up? <laughs> why am I? I don't know. What what's wrong here, guys? Why do I look? Yeah, why do I look so fucked up? I don't know. I look so fucked. Why do I look so fucked up? I look so fucked up. Why do I look so fucked up? I don't know. Loco is ripped. What in this picture? No. Loco is ripped. What in this picture gives? Hey, this is. <laughs> There's another picture. See, now I look at the camera. What am I doing? What is going on here? <laughs> I'm not sure. Pre-crisis loco. Not sure. Pre-crisis loco? No, I think this is not uh, pre-crisis. I think this is the most recent one. I think it's Home Story Cup 22. <laughs> That's funny. <sighs> Definitely baked. Definitely not baked, man. Definitely not. Just tired. You know, I used to go to home store and then I would do like a 14 hours like, driving. I need like at least a day from that shit. This is such a short amount of time. Look on Motan. Lenny will be answering any questions. You'll These days, Lenny does better than. Gifting a. 10. 3 out of 10. That will check Discord chat again. Oh, God. Three out of ten. Three out of ten. That was an attempt. Hey, thanks for the hype train. Madam rounding it up to <laughs> That's pretty good. That's pretty good. <laughs> what are these <laughs> This is before anybody looked at the camera. Mm -mm. Yeah, it's on burst. Dad took the pictures. No. To the beautiful city of... To get any better. Exactly. Mila. You are amazing. In years. She looks... I mean... Oh, look at Haley. All by yourself. Boys. I don't know. God, just go forward. Right, right. Where am I? Oh, take notes. My character knows how to dance. Is that all you're looking for? Twitch chat is a big. Let's do it. <clears throat> Let's do it. Okay, chat, take notes. My character knows how to dance. Where am I? Oh, there I am with my pink hat, of course. Okay, yes. Step forward, right, 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 step forward. Oh, fast steps. Good. God, this goes fast, man, I'm tired. This is the whole move? This is kind of cool, though. Dude, it's tw I <laughs> in twenty. I regular printing volume. I guess is we. This is kind of cool. Logo. See, that is cool. I like that a lot. I've no okay. Chat, take notes. My character knows how. To step right, right. Step forward. Fast. Good. It's fast, man. I'm tired. This is the whole move. This is all we're doing. I can do it. That was amazing. Yeah, time to go home. That was that was great. Okay, well I got some decorations. This one. Hmm. Would you say my bedroom looks a little busy? <laughs> say, oh god, this is a horrible spot. What over here? Can I? Nice bed. Fucking like. Are those man? This is a disaster. Like how?
I actually want to go... Up. Okay, I filled that one. Walk uh, and jump towards ridged walls to wall run. Okay. Okay, I filled that one first one, but the game is very forgiving. Who taught you to move like that? My master. Every time I fell, he got me back on my feet. Sounds like a good teacher to me. Oh, it's slippery? Slippery when... I would very much so like a jetpack, actually. I thought I could go further down. It looks... It looks... Further. No... Okay, fine. Um, so... What did I get? Ooh... I should have gone with literally any other color. Anyways. It's good on pig, general. I feel like I'm dipping below 60 FPS sometimes. Am I crazy? It's a little bit of, uh... Boom! Get him. Feels really nice. Yeah, if you guys could maybe count the frames, that'd be great. Thank you. So every second that goes by, please count to 60. It's not a problem, I guess, on stream. Press or hold R1. But I can just. What are you doing, mate? Do your thing. I have a pet? Thank you very much. Melvin, two years! I appreciate you. What was that move? Why did you. Quit reading my mind, Jedi. What was that move? Why did you do it backwards? It's like diving into the. He just did that to look cool. Okay. A local directory. Data. I think I played Survivor. Or not Survivor. Uh, Fallen Order on the PC. I'm pretty sure I played it on the PC. Because I remember some uh, some frame dip-ins as well back then. Well, I can change the stance? <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> we could just murder everybody, dude. We have... Ooh, cocktails? Yo, if anyone wants a cocktail, I'm let me know. This. Right? No, I had a I had a cocktail in uh Press O to quickly rec Hey guys! Press L3 and R3 to slow enemies around Cal. Oh I think this is my Spartan Rage. What? I can slow down time while everything else stays at regular speed. You guys, it's kind of annoying. Oh, he helped. He did it. Nah, you helped. I agree, dude. You killed one. Thanks, these cities, man. What if I just have my... Oh, okay. I don't even really need to time it. So it only... I think it only reflects. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It only reflects if I do it correctly. Exactly. I took about half my HP worth of damage. The game was like, yo, this guy needs an extra skill point. The Emperor turned the Jedi Temple. Day job. Oh. I love how your buddy just casually flies around the obstacles. Yeah, yeah. He could probably take me with him, you know? Hey, guys. Oh, shit. I'm almost. That was so slow. Oh, okay. Happened there? Lexes are incredible. Those fire faster than plasma. Necessarily. It was pretty great. Kinda of feels like we're running backward. I don't by This is where I go and do stuff? Just hitting uh, my on others. So I want to see how this game plays when you get to a different location, you know? So I remember in the previous game there were some optimization things as well on the PC that were a little funky. But on some worlds it was much better than on others. So I want to see how this game plays when you get to a different location, you know? There's a good chance it will run smoother when there aren't. It would still be a little, little ridiculous. That feels really nice. Really tanky. 
Wait, I. Oh shit! I can throw my blade. Was I supposed to already? Be I have a boomerang attack. Well, I mean. Oh, it requires force. I see. Come on, buddy. Battlefront 2 and two hours over here. I guess I need to go back. Those random game review websites. Are negative. Okay, I've. Hey guys. What am I doing? Maybe I just have a nap. There's definitely a chance that I am just really good at somehow by playing it in the only unanticipated and unintended way. <laughs> $80. It's 80 euro, not Brian. That's like $90. But that fire also looks very mediocre, no? Maybe I just have a knack for like finding those things, but I gotta take out. There's definitely a chance. Over? Can I go over? Unanticipated and un It's 80 euro, not Brian. That's like $90. But that fire also looks very mediocre, no? Look how jittery it is. Look at the fire. I don't know if it looks the same on stream as it does for me, but like... Oh, here's the Night Sister again. Casters! I thought you were gonna be the final boss. Oh, not the case. What am I even... Can I parry? <laughs> no! I don't want to quit playing games. This is what I do for a living. Oh, stop playing with this, I guess. Impressive. But you're hurting bad inside, Kestis. I can sense it. Dragon Ball Z character now. Like if Jedi's are not allowed. The sisters are a Vader project? Oh, okay. What am I? I don't know with these fights. How? It parries, right? Full stance acquired. Last strikes. Ow. Wait, do I respawn in the middle? It's on one HP to respawn in that fight. Okay. I feel like this is quite a while back, no? It's basically like a Souls like. Yeah, yeah, it really is. I don't think it's cool. Start. What is going on, everybody? Welcome back again to another live stream. It is currently the 29th of April, 2023. My name is Loco. Okay, I think the bar is hiding it. Oh my god. People may have the weakness, the structure if you're a can pot. Now, it doesn't run terrible. It like, it doesn't look, look at my face right now. It doesn't even look that good. I forgot about my, uh, my mullet. But like, if this is supposed, uh, I, yeah. So everybody is talking about the terrible. Perf Thank you, Legend of Doom. Yeah. So everybody is talking about the terrible performance of this game on the PC. But like, if this is supposed, uh, I'm playing on the PS5, right? Like, if this is supposed to be the clapping going, the good performance. Um, whoa, that loading in is wild. Oh, I forgot about my. But like. If Supposed to be the clapping going. The good performance. Whoa, that loading in is wild. Oh, I must the game. It like it doesn't look. Look at my face right now. It doesn't even look that good. The gameplay has been really fun, but it 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 has severe performance problems. What is that? What is going on right now in the background? What is that? F If I get really tilted by it though, I will probably just end up um, delaying this playthrough until they release patches, because it is just uh, a bit of a mess. What is this? What is this? Oh shit! I old scrap. Patches, because it is. What is this? I know. I will probably in the background. What is that? F I 
Hey, thank you very much. Yeah. Statement? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so they specify we are aware aware that Star Wars Jedi. Yeah, so they specify we are aware that Star Wars percentage of our PC players. <laughs> and with percentage of PC players, they mean 98%. It's, uh, you know, they, yeah, it's, it's a small amount. It, it's okay. And EA already doesn't have the highest standards, man. Their standards are pretty fucking low. Their standards are pretty fucking low. Their standards are pretty fucking low. Pretty, pretty fucking low. Anyways, for example, and this is a weird one, players using cutting-edge multi-threaded uh, chipsets designed for Windows 11 were encountering problems on Windows 10. Are they saying it's the fault of the plating here? Like, I'm reading this, I read this this morning, there's... That's weird. Yeah. It's... Hmm. Rest assured, we are working to address these cases quickly. <laughs> Anyways, um, I'm playing on the PS5. It's a, uh, I think that this is uh, acceptable performance on the PlayStation. I'm not exactly sure. But yeah, that's your fault, man, for using Windows, Ele or Windows 10 rather than Windows 11. Yeah. Hey, thank you, Orbital Wave, so I can show you guys my new haircut. was about... Um, so I, um, with like the shaved no, sights, okay. but only party in the in this game. Can I get another one of those balls over there? As Meteor wants to Z, my yeah, exactly. He can access memories. This so far has had bad performances. Well, Diablo. Ooh, you're getting. You've been without a gaming PC for ten years. games to catch on, dude. Oh, you're just getting a new computer. Gotcha. You've been on the old. Without a gaming PC for. You've been without a gaming PC for ten years. Dang. Got a lot of good games to catch on, dude. To catch up. Oh, you're just getting a new computer. Gotcha. You've been on the old computer for 10 years. I see. What's that? Uh, there's a giant circle. Well, I figured that would be it. <laughs> oh no. A puzzle, guys. Does this blue thing do anything? Ah. Not bad. I wouldn't risk it if it was my life, Cal, but it's yours, so I think we're good. It's a partial one. This is through the eyes of a old Zet. The key to Tam Santari Kari? How do you He's acting and all that. I love the sound of fantastic job. Yeah, occasionally my man Cal here gets a um a, um, a vision, I guess, of things when he gets close to them. We don't really know exactly how, I don't think, but... As Meteor streak across Kobo Sky, Santari Kuri charges the droid ZNA4, or Z, or ZNA4, to recover the Panalor from the Forest Array. Unbeknownst to Z, Master Kree just purged all knowledge of how to navigate the Kobo Abyss from the droid's memory banks. Yeah, but he can, yeah, exactly. He can access memories of droids. Also things that are, but maybe I'm mistaken. It doesn't have to be a living thing. Can I get another one of those balls over there? Is that possible? Yeah, exactly. He can I get another one of those balls over there? Is that possible? No, I'm probably going to have to pass along this one right over here. 
Yeah, I guess it's a unique skill. Am I supposed to be able to grab that from here? No, hitting a lightsaber. I can try and hit her with a lightsaber. Uh, the orb coupler. That must be this thing right over here. Can I? I can I throw my thing? No. What is this? No. Can I throw? Request a hint. Let's see. How does it work? Looks like the orbs activate these bridges. <laughs> I figured that one out, mate. I just need another orb. Hey, what's going on? Low prime. Hi. Have I bugged the game? No, no, no. I'm just very good. Good at. Have I bugged the game? No, no, no. I'm just very good at not figuring out puzzles that are seemingly very obvious for everybody. Um. So I put one of those orb balls over there. Um. So I put one of those orb balls over there. There, one of those orb things came out of the wool. I'm gonna need to get another one of those orbs out of a wool somewhere else. And put them in these locations. Where do I get the orbs from, though? Anyone any suggestions? Feel free to play along, by the way. I uh, sometimes get stuck on these really dumb puzzles. If you have any calls, uh, feel free to help me along. I can jump through that thing? I don't think I can I can climb up here, no. Oh well I can fall down here, in case you were wondering about that. <laughs> can I jump up from here? No. Can I jump up from I just jump across the cat? I don't think so. I can try. I don't think I can. No, these things are also not. Is there an opening somewhere? Can I wall run across this? No. Can I get a stem BD? Five steps and I get stuck again, guys. Absolute classic. That wall on the other side of the room, but I don't think I can go over there. It feels like I need to go up, but I can't make that. I need to activate. Yeah, I don't know where to go, Eliminator. I'm a little confused by some of these puzzles sometimes. That's nothing new, though. That's nothing to do with the game. That's definitely a loco thing. So I tried using pool to recover the first ball. This is pool right over here. There was another orb behind the gate. Another orb? There's one orb that came out over there. There's another orb? Oh, sh one behind. Oh shit, there's one behind over. Oh sh oh, shit. Oh, sh there's one behind over there. What the fuck? Over there? What the fuck? What the f what the f fuck? What the f Uh, I need to definitely be able to grab that somehow, but how in the world would I push a wall? That's crazy hard to see. Am I cra- I didn't realize I could make that. Using this ball- I feel like reusing this ball is a, a good idea, but... Make this jump over here, then. Because I definitely have to get across- 
No. Uh, um, no. I think I can jump. Yeah, the lower I have to go across over here. That wall running wall over. What am I looking for? You think I'm supposed to jump back? How am I- how am I for what seems like five minutes? Somebody must have completed this game by now. Or- or this section at the very least. I can't pull out the orb. I- I- I can't pull this one out. Uh, I can't really watch YouTube videos while I'm streaming this game on the PlayStation 5, Bunny. I can't watch that. This one- this one is no longer accessible somehow. Wait, the guy in the video pulls this orb? Huh? I did the same thing so many times. Oh, wait, I can... I'm more of a poncho guy. This is my pulling button, though. This is what I tried doing already, though. How did I just do it? You can pull it from the other side? This is my pull button, no? Am I doing it wrong? L2 is the button I use, right? This is what I've been using the entire game long so far. There's no way this is the intended solution. I did it once just now, but I don't know how. Yeah, I pulled it... Uh, I pulled it while I was on the bridge earlier. Did I break things? Again? Yeah, I did the same thing 17 times. Seriously, I did the same thing over and over and over again. Lock on doesn't work. No, I can't lock on. Lock on is R3. This is what happens when I hit R3. It just centers in whatever direction Kao is facing. Why am I so good at breaking games? Stand on the bridge, if you pull it, you fall. That's my whole problem though, I can't pull it. I understand that the bridge is not the location where I eventually want to be able to pull it, but I'm trying to understand how I... You know, the pull-out mechanic, how does it work? Do you think it's just bugged? I... don't understand. Maybe I have to stand closer here? The fuck am I doing wrong? Okay, I'm gonna reload things. Fuck am I- The f fuck am I doing am I doing am I- am I The f am I doing- Okay, I'm gonna reload things. Last saved 18 minutes ago? No, I'm holding the button over- over here. It doesn't change anything. How did I do it a couple of times? Yeah, EA told me it's basically my fault. Though. So how did it work twice? I accidentally... Mate. Okay, I guess I'll have to go all the way back. I mean, it's not like I really was moved very far forward, but... Maybe I should have installed Windows 11 on my PlayStation 5. Maybe I should have installed Windows 11 on my PlayStation 5. Almost reminds me. <sighs> yeah, I think it must have bugged out. First instinct was to try and pull the orb across, but I it didn't work. So I tried every other option. And then, apparently, what I tried first was actually the correct call. It's just bugged. Okay. Okay, we're back here. Let's see if we can hit Pool. Push. Bridge activates. 
Here's Death the Robot. Can I skip it? I can skip it, okay? Let's start back. I was stuck there for 18 minutes. Are you kidding me? <laughs> okay. Works the first time. Right now, I'm gonna be very surprised. Okay. What am I- what is the problem, mate? What am I doing wrong? Okay, I'm gonna- I'm gonna look at that video Bunny Warren linked me. Uh, let's see. What's going on? What's the problem? He just- He just pulls it! He just- Huh? I just reloaded. Oh, EA. Hey, come on, man. I paid 80 euro for your fucking game. What? I paid 80 euro for, for your fucking game. I paid 80 euro for your f***ing game, why is it so bad? Seriously. Um, so what do I do? I already quit. Yeah, this game is 80 euro. No, it's definitely not my controller for Formless Void, because I just once I pulled it from there and then I put it over there. I should be able to pull it again. It's definitely not my controller, man. It's 100% the game. The guy just walks over here and pulls that randomly. What in the world, dude? Okay, I will try one more thing. Um, I will go all the way back over here. Can I? Can I, how do you close the game? Can I, how do you close the game? I guess I can start up another game that will probably close the one that I have over there. No, they never sent me a key for the game. They, they reached out a month asked if I wanted a key. So I was like, yes, please. And then they never sent me one. <laughs> Which is also kind of weird. I don't know. We didn't start off the best food, me and, and Jedi uh, Survivor or whatever the fuck the game is called. A survivor or whatever the fuck the fuck game. <laughs> game is called. So I ended up buying the game. I got baited by EA. Yeah, it's okay. I think something must. Have it's. It's a little funny. Okay, so I closed the game. We're rebooting the entire thing. There's people in the EA forums with the exact same problem of not being able to pull the orb after the cutscene. Okay, so did they figure out a solution? What? They didn't? Wait, they just... What? They didn't? Wait, for real? Almost reminds me of the Jedi. They didn't- wait, they just didn't find a solution? <laughs> so what? They just- I just restarted the full game, yes. If this doesn't work, I am out of ideas. <laughs> there's- there's nothing else. Oh, did some of them restarted the entire game? Oh, did some of them restarted the entire game? They just began a new playthrough? I've got, okay, okay, so someone's suggesting my controller doesn't work. It works, look, I grabbed the thing. Then I move it over here, right? We throw it in there. I can't remove it, you're stuck in a cutscene halfway across the bridge. No, you can't remove it earlier. EA game testers are sweating bullets from I think EA has game testers? Mate, I am a paying customer, and I'm the game tester. 
Back in my day, a beta tester for a game was a paid position, but these days you're paying customers are your beta testers. It's insane. Really clever. Um... Okay. Really clever. Okay. You are a Jedi! Or are my center receptors completely shot? What did I do? Completely Z. I'm a Jedi, alright. But you're not even wearing them to the <laughs> What did I do differently? Look, like, why didn't you try that earlier? I know, mate. I should have just tried that earlier. That's insane. Wait, some people also have problems with the second orb? They also get stuck on the second orb? Oh, okay, I thought I could jump. I can't jump with that one. Fair enough. Uh, I need to open up the thing somehow. Can I throw the orb? Yeah, yeah. This is electronic art right here, guys. At this point, must be thinking as well, guys. What the fuck? What? <laughs> thinking as well, guys. What the fuck? Why did we work with you? I did it! That only took 30 minutes longer than it needed to. Fantastic. Well, we're not out of this yet. Let's not get too excited. Okay, got some new jet. It's a puzzle for, uh, you know, your sanity. Just to confirm whether or not. Oh, that one we're doing. <laughs> Apparently, seals are actually not very good for this one so far. In general, apparently, the 80 euro price tag they're asking for modern games is hurting seals quite a bit. I don't know if that has to do with macroeconomics, where people are just in general are less inclined right now to buy more expensive games, but apparently, uh... Yeah, I wonder why, right? That's crazy, I don't know. It's insane. Well, this is a respawn game, right? EA is... Is respawn owned by EA these days? I actually don't just joined? What's up, Morty? You missed the best part of the stream, dude. Anything EA touches turns to gold. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Shit, Chet. Gonna get banned off of the internet. Don't mind looking cute. These music... Rocking the mullet. Gonna do whatever shit, yeah. Okay that we saw that was broken and all that, but I think I might just be able to climb up over here in my book. Needed to out. Untamed Downs was your nice. I don't have the VODs for my Cyberpunk playthrough. No. I wanted to post... Um... Leads to the main... Oh, I don't think so. I don't have the VODs for my Cyberpunk playthrough. No. I wanted to post that playthrough to more loco. That playthrough? Dude, there's some people that... Right, and I pull... There's some people that think... I am complaining in this game the entire time, right? And I apologize, I don't mean to be complaining the entire time, but if you really want to hear me complain for like 30 hours straight, you should have seen my Cyberpunk playthrough. I had like the no nudity filter on. There was a no nudity filter, and I remember a very distinct scene out in the desert in a fucking... in a... fucking... Like, tank? Or whatever it was? Like, tank? Or whatever it was? Anyways, I think my, uh, micro on these buttons over here to switch out of the- out of the- I think it was pretty good, but the tank scene was something truly special, uh, that suddenly wasn't covered anymore by- the no nudity uh, setting in the game. Yeah. I heard Cyberpunk is really good now. Who the fuck's out there playing Cyberpunk? Who the fuck's out there playing Cyberpunk? 
But you know what? At the same time, they also made now. But you know what? At the same time, they also made more money than they ever made before, just in the first week of the release. So, you know, marketing, I guess, is just gonna make up for making a shitty game. Just make up for making a shitty. Making a shitty. Making a shitty. Making a shitty game because people will buy whatever they release again next time too this buddy playing cyberpunk yeah i heard cyberpunk is amazing now yeah <sighs> uh -uh. you would imagine at some point that gaming developers are like you know what let's finish the game before we release it <laughs> like seriously what's the downside i don't quite understand it's like no 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 what about we release a shitty version of the game we release a shitty. We release a shit. We release a shitty. Version of the game instead. That's that's that would you know great idea. Okay, I'm gonna increase my maximum life because every time I've died so far, it's because my health went down to zero. So I've got a feeling if I make it so that my health doesn't go down to zero as quickly, I'll probably live for long. Indie games, dude. Indie games are killing it right now. Yeah. Corporate hey, overlords demanding deadlines really are just... Ugh. So it's gotta be the same for this one too, man. There's a chance somebody's watching this in like a year from now. This game is probably excellent by then. What is this? Is this is a boss room. It looks like a boss from the future. If you're from the future. Open this door. I don't know how you would do that, but that's how the future. Works. Button. <laughs> now I'm gonna ask myself every time whether or not I am fucking up or if the game is happened for the rest of the. Why doesn't it do anything? No, you should not be plotted for food, bro. I think it's bugged. There's nothing else. Seriously, there's nothing. Press it at a certain. Oh no, it's just a red. So why can't I go here? Let me go. New uh, Zelda game. Do you think Nintendo still? Has I mean, I remember the most. Nah, I'm sure. Ni nah, the door is red. Okay. You can really tell we. Somehow it's red, or it's not red. You called me Burgundy. Maroon. I haven't heard about Maroon. The main singer in some. Really too up to date. Oh, I don't know what he looks like. Now you want one as well. The door. I get it. true. Big true. We have 37 subs today? We're already at 37 subs today? How do we get to 37 subs already? 37 subs? Are you for real? I feel like we haven't. Did we get to 37 subs? Are you for real? I feel like we haven't had 37 subs. Am I crazy? I feel like we had like 15. Check Banka, Nolan, I lost, slightly drunk gaming, Kiwi Samurai, Pablo, Mathenes, Hash Avenue, Legend of Doom, White Knight. That's 10. Orbital Wave, Faradel, Mr. One Penguin, Tanzalins, Kits, that's 15. Gray Fox, Dark Rat, Agaring, Andy TV, Flying Lurker, that's 20. Bro, even my daily sub bar is bugged. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> What the f This stream is a disaster, man. This is like a one of the wor worst streams I've done over the last month. <laughs> Let's debug it. <laughs> I'm inflating my own net worth. Yeah, man, the Dutch fucking tax after me. I'm inflating my own net worth. Yeah, man, the Dutch fucking And the Dutch fucking tax The 
Dutch tax authorities are going to come after me with my inflated sellout bar over here. Hey, thank you very much, Hendra, for the 63 months. <laughs> That'd be amazing. I mean, it would not be amazing, amazing. But, but, amazing, amazing, but... <sighs> I just found out that our arch is not a real word. I can't. Oh, boo. He just found out ar not a real word. Find a bomb. Thank you for the just use a lightsaber. The guy doesn't really use his lightsaber. Lightsaber is a a box car. Yeah, apparently respawn is part of EA now though. Apparently they got bought. My guy cannot climb up here. What do you think, Echo Soldier? I ended up buying the Mustang. Good find. <laughs> Bro. Like I would charge you. I look like I would charge you for a beer at a party. Bro, the green reflection. Look at this shit. What is this? You can literally count the pixels. There's like 12 of them. Jeez. I wonder if I switch to. I don't want to play on quality mode. But do you think this looks better on quality mode? It's embarrassing, guys. Okay, so performance mode is supposed to prioritize FPS. This is supposed to prioritize graphics. Well, it looks the fucking same to me. It just now runs at 30 FPS. Looks the fucking same. Well, it looks the fuck. Well, it looks looks the fucking Same to me. It just now runs at 30 FPS. So it doesn't look like that on the Xbox? It really doesn't? So it... <sighs> it did look a tiny bit better. Look at that ref reflection. Insane. I feel like it, it, it... I would be surprised if the Xbox looks noticeably better, but... You know what, though? Despite the jank, I am still enjoying myself. I don't know how much longer, but... No, Plague Till Requiem is... The story is jank. The story in this game is intriguing so far. The writers did a good job. The writers did a good job. The people that made the characters are doing a good job. I think my main character is kind of boring, if I'm being honest with you, but all the other characters are interesting. I don't give a shit about Cal. Interesting. I don't give a shit about... Interesting. I don't give a shit about... I don't give a shit... I don't give a shit about... 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 Other characters are interesting. I don't give a shit about Cal, if I'm being honest. I mean, I like his mustache, I like his mullet, but that's really where my love for him ends. I care more about BD1, the guy on my back, than I care about Cal. <laughs> I wish I was joking, but uh, yeah, my main character's not very interesting. He's just kind of like your, you know, obvious good guy protagonist. But the other characters are pretty neat. Okay. This reverse gives a per looks like he's fact of us. Number facts. 43 is the smallest. That's good. My character looks like he's from the 70s. That's good. 
good, right? Hey, Muktafus. Number facts. 43 is the smallest non-palindromic prime which on subtracting its reverse gives a perfect square. 43 to 34 equals 32. Okay, nerd. Jeez. Get him, BD1! Looks like it's blocked. Jeez. Thank you very much, Muck. Hope you're doing all right. How is 32 a square number, though? Did you just make that bullshit up? If <laughs> Did you just make that bullshit up? Bullshit. Bullshit. up. Shit up. You just make that bullshit up. If <laughs> You can- you can prove anything. <laughs> How is 43 minus 34 32? <laughs> you know, if you just math enough, if you just use enough math words, I will believe you at some point, but... <laughs> that- no, no. I don't think that works. Wait, it was correct? You meant something else? Twitch can't write square? Oh, you mean c to the s to the power of the okay? So it wrote thirty two, but you meant three to the second. You're a math major, Echo Soldier. Why do I have a hard time believing that? I don't know. I don't know why I have a hard time believing it. It's not to be mean or anything. I just have a hard time. <laughs> Onwards next time. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna switch games for today. We'll continue onwards next time. I just have a hard time. <laughs> next time. Why I have a hard time believing it. It's not to be mean. There you go. You just had to make sure the little number. Fine as possible that is funny she just sort of end up <laughs> like you know. Maps available? Parts in the chat for Mr. Bunny. Yeah. Uh, say, um. Video over here is fantastic. Counter Strike 1 or Counter Strike. <laughs> this, okay. This, this video over here is fantastic. I clicked on this a couple days ago and I thought it was really. A so brief. This is a, um. I think, I think what they did is they, they have like an AI reading stuff. Have you joined me on this um, I think I have joined me on this epic journey our expedition it's so so our advances. it's just so eerily accurate it's so good this is what we need AI for yeah yeah this is this is what we need <sighs> anyways guys I'm gonna do a little bit of Starcraft to start things off and then later today is the new That's the Florence. There's a queen. Money. I don't think it was really that great for me. I actually don't think bringing a queen's. I don't know. Um. So now I used to be very fond of my. Uh, realize that my opponent has a sovereign. Get out of here. Blocker. Yeah, it's a bit anticlimactic, I realize. A couple pork chips would be nice. That's it. 
Best money I've ever spent. That was worth it. Well worth the money. I Second stream of the day. Welcome back, everybody. My opponent. <laughs> yeah, I was a bit anticlimactic. I realize that. My Ah, uh, Brenda! Karen! Get out of here! Blocker! He seems to be very fond of my, uh, my wall off. Um, so now what, guys? I guess, um, well, I can cancel. I should have probably been droning. So I got a little scared there. Because, like, you may have noticed there were about five, five dozen units on the front. But I could have just kept droning there. Yeah, I'm actually going to have to go for an attack. Uh, should I, though? I don't know. This is a bit awkward. I helped that pretty easily. I think it was really that great for me. If I could kill that, that'd be nice. Yep. It's a little more than I anticipated. That was a lot of drones. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa. That was a lot of drones I just... That's a little more than I anticipated, I'll be honest with you. Plus one is not done yet. Yeah, it finishes right now. The queen's to this party too. He probably doesn't have injects now. The queen kill my base, that's fine. Okay. I was gonna go. Shaky there. But plus one roaches are pretty good. I figured though, since he sent the queens in, that I was actually... Like, he's got 700 minerals in the bank. I don't think he should have sent in the queens, but... That was a little closer than it needed to be. <laughs> Thank you very much, uh, Shadow T for the 22 months. And again, Mr. Bunny. That's yeah, I don't think it should have sent in the queen. That was closer than it needed to be. <laughs> like sometimes it doesn't know how to clearly understand how the sellout bar works sometimes. Shape is contagious, apparently. And it uses three control. That may grow a month. Not a patch, it's not money or anything else. I like how he occasionally releases a new video. It's about a random subject. Does your flag fail? Great or great? I have never. F Does your flag fail? I really wish a great. Um, it's a flag, not a note this, that you're passing in class. This, this is where all the Americans. This is why words on a flag. Z this is what I was talking about. A tier list within a tier list, because like you. That's all you That is, I, I have never really thought about our American state flags, but they're all the same color of blue. They're... <laughs> it's F. It's okay, hold on. They're cursed? No, oh, dude. That... Montana, this kerning. No. Dude. Ironically, each... <laughs> that is... Oh, oh, an objection. You have a... Wait, Oregon literally has two... Wait, there is... Fills the category of a kid needs to be able to draw it. This, I guess, only if category of flag. Oh, it has a B site, the beaver site. Hmm. Yeah. Just ditch. Hmm. Yeah. You just ditch the front of your flag and be all in on the beaver. Hey, I, w I wouldn't be laughing. Three weeks and they still have been. <laughs> but there's no people that live twice. See, that's a good flag. Good. I like one that lived in North Dakota. I can confirm nobody lives in North Dakota. Yeah, that's dope right there. 
Island and uh, this YouTube channel is called CGP. Uploads very sporadic, um, but they're all excellent. Energy to Cute. How does it even work if you want to up? Is there some sort of system in place? Like, say the country or the state you live in is like, yo, we don't have been around like a first world country that's changed it at some point. It has to be quite complex. Just ditching the old one is definitely not going to happen. New Zealand tried? Oh, they had a vote on it? Yeah, I saw Fran France apparently changed the color over the last decade or so. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. So the top section of this picture is the old flag. The bottom section is way nicer. Oh. The Japan changed in 2020. Next. That's... I want to see a full bar. This was the the princess. Yeah, right. So some. Yeah. In particular, those. There's a spire. Watching this. This. Is it really? Oh, OSX. They'll just call it Windows. Windscape. For Windows 12, they'll probably not. No, no, no. They'll, they'll probably go straight to Windows 15 or whatever. Seriously, like, do you think they're gonna do a Windows 12? You're, win you're waiting for Windows 12? They'll probably not. No, no, no. They'll, they'll probably go straight to Windows 15 or whatever. Seriously, like, do you think they're gonna do a Windows 12? I don't think so. I think they'll, pr yeah, they'll sooner go Windows 20 than Windows 12. I think they'll skip the 12. Windows X? Yeah, Windows Series X. X. Windows 12 is in development? Is it really? The, you know, the work in progress name. Fun. <laughs> in progress name. Name. Windows 1. <laughs> yeah. Windows 1. One is actually not a, a name that people would be surprised by. Or they'll just... They'll just call it Windows again. Like, it'll just be Windows. That's the whole name. What's new in Windows 12? Well, when Microsoft hasn't officially announced Windows... Got an early look at a prototype? Wait, the CEO... showed it off? For real? There will be a weather widget, Wi-Fi and battery indicators. They made what ma Oh my god, that thing at the top of the screen? Wait! They made what Mac OS has had since fucking... OS has had since fucking... Well, OS X? Oh, what? Well, they also have cur curved borders as like in, in a dock. This is what Mac has as well. Now it's just full width. I mean, to be fair, they changed a lot though. Uh, the very first versions that they've ever shared of UIs is always, it's always very different. Improvements to widgets. Nobody uses widgets. widgets. Improvements to widgets nobody uses widgets who do, who's out there using widgets enhanced start menu customization uh i hate everything about that live wallpapers okay you use widgets unify by settings and control panel okay that's actually pretty hype it's gonna be very annoying for the sysadmins in the chat but uh for everybody else Snap layout, but editable. Right, I use Fancy Zones for that already. Fancy Zones is great. Easier to uninstall apps. Back in my day, we used to call them programs. We'll see, guys. Good old... We'll see, guys. Good old, good old Windows. It's not like people are gonna switch away from Windows anyway. Nah. Calling programs apps is cursed? 
It is a little curse, isn't it? Like, it, in a weird way, I don't cons like the calculator app. I'm okay with that, right? Using the calculator app on your Windows. But calling StarCraft 2 an app? Photoshop? Or Photoshop? Like, there is a difference. Calling Photoshop an app is already very cringe. Yeah. Oh my god, that's true. They're gonna rename program files to X or... Oh my god. App files? If they rename program files to app files, that would be so funny, but... Also a little painful. Every break. Every bit of old software is instantly gonna break. They're all applications, I get that. But... Yeah, yeah, everything that's not... Wait, app data already exists? Really? Windows 11 has app data rather than program files? Or like, they have app files rather than... Yeah, app data is something else. Yeah, no, app data is not the same as, as program files though. They've had that for a long time. That's where the save game files go. You know it would be really nice? If game developers would actually be using the My Games folder. That's in documents, hanging up with their own names. That would be really nice. That would be so sweet. The documents folder just has a whole bunch of different folders in it. Everybody's got their own stuff. Some some games put their stuff in my games, but yeah, it's just a lot of them don't use it. No, technically you can move them, loco. I know, but I don't want to do that. Loco, how much money for you to play League of Legends? Legends? I'm the best guarantor, mate. I am WTR. This Link, Gabe. This is from the Windows 12 prototype? Why is the search bar so big? This is from the Windows 12 prototype? Why is the search bar so big? Why why is the whole bar search? There's another search bar up there too though. I I do already sort of hate this. I'll be honest with you. I also don't like the recommended. Maybe I'm wrong. But like recommended, really? I turn all of that stuff off on my phone own as well. I don't like that. Um, when the, the software is trying to predict what I'm most likely going to be using next, for some reason, I'm not a fan. Even if it would be good, I still wouldn't like it. Like, it's sort of like an, yeah, exactly. It's like an ad in your start menu. It kind of feels like it. I'm not a fan. But, I mean, I think you, you can turn this off in Windows 11, right? It would probably recommend a hidden porn folder. I mean, I wouldn't mind that, but it's just kind of silly. <laughs> if it <laughs> if it just recommends six different types, though, then it gets a little spicy. Yeah, if it gives you quick access to six different folders right away, that's a little. Uh, what is this? What did you just link? What am I looking at? This is OS X in like 2007. Red Star OS, North Korean Linux distribution? Wait, this is the current version? Oh my god, I've never seen this before. Red Star OS features a fight Mozilla Firefox called Nenara, My Country in Korea, or in Korean, which is used for browsing the Nenara web portal. Other software includes a text editor, an office suite, an email client, audio and video players, file sharing software, and video games. Yeah, but people that know what they're doing, if it's just running Linux, they can break out of that shit very easily, no? They can break out of that shit. People that know what they're doing can, if it's just running Linux, they can 
software and video games. So wait. <laughs> this is... I would have to know, I guess. Interesting. So wait. <laughs> this is the 1.0 edition, which definitely is not Windows XP. And this is the 3.0 edition, which is definitely not Mac OS. Interesting. It's about a decade behind in, in UI, but... <laughs> Latest release is 4.0. That's wild, man. Look, I'll tell your boss to let you have bank holidays off. We don't have a... Yo, if this is actually what Windows 12 currently looks like in its prototype, that is wild. That is basically macOS. This is exactly what macOS looks like. It just has a finder thing in the top left, and this one, I guess, has a start menu over here, but, like, this is it. Well, I, I per personally do like macOS, but... I know that is a dangerous thing to say on the internet. Okay, I'm gonna do one more ladder game and then I'll on the internet. Okay, I'm gonna do- You always wanted Mac OS without Apple? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I've been winning today. Loss. A win. You always wanted Mac OS without Apple? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> well, there you go, dude. Maybe Windows 12 will be what you're looking for. Mac OS without Apple. I think I'm gonna play a little bit of Terra Nil. I really want to uh, the Star Wars game again. Fun. Uh, above 5K. Well played by this guy. Men making a big land of space. <laughs> it's just a career. Okay. Before I made it. How was I? Heh. I appreciate you. Thank you very much. <clears throat> I casted a series between Bjorn and Maru, and they once again were chatting at the start of it. Game one, I'm serious. Did you eat? Nah. What did you eat? Water? Are you a hippo? Does smell good? My eyes are itchy? Rub it? Rubbing it? Good job. I'm a bit busy in this match. Sorry. Careful. Okay. Okay, good boy. I am. Nice. I know. Fuck you. Nice. I know. Fuck, Fuck you. We're going to have it so that... Whoever stops chatting is going to lose. Good luck. Why the middle? What? I can't remember. To pick on? Search it right now. Yes. Lol. Bye. That's not nice. Why are mine the only ones disappearing? Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. Thank you. <laughs> ha. Easy to read. Just like a book. Okay. Great job. Thanks. Eat you up. Lol. Good job. So good. So sweet. Ha. Fuck. Go away. What the fuck? Go away. That's good. Very. Thanks. It's hard to chat because of my shoulder. That's what I'm aiming for. I so today chatting? So why would I be pit? <laughs> okay. I have no idea to confirm any of these translations, but I am gonna assume... Yeah, they sound like chat GPT. They really do. <laughs> Korean language is a little different. What does it mean? It means you're a bitch. What, what the fuck? It was basically the same translation. <laughs> That's a lot, you know. Let's go down.
You missed the chopper shows? Yeah. Thousands of lives of Panizer HD 560S. <laughs> Warfield is done. Another Gorgon. Warfield is done. Another Gorgon. General, let's try something else like more siege tank. The Zerk can spread out in the bone trench. We have flooded the tunnel, so no night is where we'll pop it. Uh, it will be much easier to defend than with a gigantic, unwieldy ship. Another Gorgon. You're throwing out thousands of lives and tens of thousands of hours of hard labor, amounts of precious resources for a tactic that the Zerk has a clear counter for, sir. Send another Gorgon. Another Gorgon. Warfield. Yeah, Warfield is kind of dumb. Yeah, no. He is, uh... For a general, right? For a master tactician and all that? Uh, yeah, no. Not very good. Not very good. Not very good. Chopper shows? Yeah, this was actually really fun. They had these on uh, the Dutch Discovery Channel, too. American Chopper is... Uh, really I, I watched it I uh, I watched this a very long time ago though years ago I don't know when they stuff these guys do these days interesting result circle and a Gerald then Maru versus life but I want to find I appreciate they see it that's pretty good but like it was Warcraft arena to more mutas. Not right now, anyways. <sighs> hey, thank you many loves for this. I'm trying to rot it in. So the... So wait, what about the doorknob versus door handle? Page. When you're talking about a doorknob, you're talking about this thing on the right, no? What about a doorknob? You're talking about this thing on the right, no? So these are the norm with internal rather than these? Anybody has doorknobs that I know. I'm trying to... Like, I never thought about this, but... Yeah, but you gotta twist those? Them in the past, but I don't think I know people that have them internally in the Netherlands. I don't know. Knobs are better. So dogs, I guess, can open these. Fair enough. I've had dogs for, for most, most of their open doors. So these are more of a business setting? So in like office buildings, these would be the norm? Maybe this is the problem with Rushy, man. Yeah, Rushy couldn't figure out how to open my front door. He had he had a hard time. Maybe that's the issue. The only reason handles are for jeans. For jeans, what are you doing, mate? <laughs> for jeans, I don't understand. What? You have a little thingy you press. That's kind of cute. There's a little little thumb presser thingy. Never seen this in my life. It's a trigger latch handle? Really? This is a rich person door? Yeah, that's why half of Twitch chat has it, Barnacle. It's, 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 yeah, it's got a trigger, man. I don't think I've ever seen this in my life. This is fascinating. That handle is 20. I have never seen this. This is probably an American thing. We also don't have Home Depot for what it's worth. Have you seen these way, man? Input. Am I just... Do I just not leave the house often enough? You've never seen this? Okay. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out if I'm a shut-in or like what's going on right now. What is this? No, 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 no. We've already talked about front doors in the past, okay? And I remember bringing this thing up. That was the house. 
Go in over Darren to the wall over. Queen knows a good trait. So doors that divide. Door handle, door knob. Okay, we're gonna do one pull, Chet. I need to do a pull on this. Just, I really thought we have gotten, we had gotten to the to the bottom. I rooms. Endo gang, let's go. You have. <laughs> Disturbed by this, okay. <laughs> door handle, door knob. You know, doors that divide rooms. Door handle, door knob. Handle gay. We're out right now. No. Both? Door handle gang coming in hot. That's what we're trying to figure out right now. It depends on the shape, Loco. Well, that's what we're trying to figure out right now. Right now. You have both? Okay, I didn't consider that, you know. Fuck you, handle users. Fuck. Fuck you, handle users. <laughs> This is kind of like floor gang versus, what was it, ceiling gang? You have a door with a handle on the one side and a knot on the other? Yo, j -Pi out there with the fanciest of doors. Alright, door handle gang! Let's go, man! The average loco chat user is rich? This has nothing to do with money. This has nothing to do with money. Apparently it's a cultural thing. I didn't realize it, but um... No, 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 I hate everything about that picture. Please send that to me ever again. You have sliding doors on the inside? Okay. Yeah, I'm not cool enough for sliding doors either. I learned about electric kettles a long time ago. Yeah. But that apparently has to do with voltages. The F is an electric kettle. This is living well right enjoys it i guess i don't know realizing they don't use euro characters have oh dude crops as well 80 me mott and mary you take credit for my crops then support a jojo mart credit crops that fucking guy oh shit Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Chat! It's time! I am wearing my pink hat for the occasion! Let's go, dude! When Loco first arrived in Pelican Town, no one knew if he'd fit with our community. But from this day forward, Loco is going to be as much a part of this town as any of us. It is my great honor of this day three of summer to unite Loco and Penny in the bonds of marriage. Let's get right to it. I agree, Lewis. Let's get right to it. Oh. Okay. Oh, no. no. Okay. No. Sorry. Loco Penny, as the mayor of Loco Penny, as the mayor of Pelican Town and regional bear. Sorry. Loco, right to it. Loco Penny, as the mayor of Pelican Town and regional bearer of the matrimonial seal, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss. Close your eyes, Chet. Look, that's all the birds. All the doves. Yo, Marnie. Marnie's enjoying it. Life is going to be diff- But the future looks bright! Hey, Penny, what's up? Hello? What are we doing? Okay, enough of that! Back to work! I work on my wedding day, okay? No, no. Guys, farmers can't go on a honeymoon, man. 
Man, you guys have such disrespect for where your food comes from. I can't believe it. We've had one wife, yes. What? No, I'm playing Motless. So there's no mods here. I, I'm not playing with the, uh, the different mods that you have available for the game. You can still have girlfriends? Really? Interesting. I actually didn't realize that was a thing. You can still have girlfriends? Really? Okay, game. You can still have girlfriends? Really? Interesting. I actually didn't realize that was a thing. I can kill. I can still give bouquets and everything to everybody. Oh, I can also get rabbits right now. I forgot. To seen if you date older girls in the game. There's a cutscene if you date older girls in the game. Oh, sounds like I need more diamonds, guys. I am but a diamond is We can date Sebastian and Sam. Yeah, we can we can just we can just date everybody. Sounds delicious. What may now guys? Any day now, we should be getting some thunder. No. Oh. Uh, together works like hours and hours. Uh, uh Toby, uh, I uh, can't to believe. Okay, no, I think. Oh, thanks. I guess. No, 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 no. Example of what and with killing it. I mean, there are, are standards. Wait, I guess, get but. to check your stream. What's up, Aaron? Uh, or I reached out to them asking if I could do a giveaway, but they haven't responded. So if they do, Redfall also apologized. Oh no! Oh my God! This is the exact same photograph I've seen earlier this week. We're aware that Redfall is isn't performing to our standards. Wait, is this real? Because this is not tweeted by no 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 no. This is not tweeted by the same company. No, 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 no. This is someone just trying to get some bait over here. I see how it is. Anyways. Yeah, that game is also performing incredibly well. AAA Studios, man. Bethesda and EA in particular, they're absolutely killing it. And with killing it, I mean their loyal customer base. Which already was pretty small to begin with, but... Anyways, guys, we're gonna get started with a little bit of to begin with, but... But mm -mm 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 -mm. thank you. PC optimization is hard. For example, of what uh, red face. You know. So here's a little example. Example of PC optimization is hard though. So many device combos these days. That's always been the case, Mono. So here's a little example of what. Um, Redfall is currently like, okay? So this is a new game by Bethesda that just released a couple days ago that a lot of people were excited for. Okay, sure, there's a lot of PC configurations, but look at this. I can do this forever. I don't think that's supposed to behave like this. That's a vampire. I think that's an, uh, an enemy in the game. Buddy, what are you doing? Buddy. Now you now, now he's done. I'm doing nothing. Listen, things we we, we keep around. Mm, yeah. You can buy for all of the different video games and stuff. I really like it. I got loads of plushies. There's like a lot of effort. Desert coins? What the fuck? Off no, 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 no. I have one. Luxury coin? Ooh, I have, but I just keep them in the closet right over there behind. So I sort of have them. Uh, Milo in particular. So I have a few of these coins. Anniversary coin. Oh, I have one of those. I have a few of these coins. Does anyone know where it came from? Um. Uh, um. Was it BlizzCon? eBay list PAX East? No, I've been to PAX East. It's from BlizzCon. I paid pig. Wait. I've had. F what? 
Wardy says I've had $350 ordered for one... Offered for one of those? It's one of the rarest Blizzard coins? What the fuck? I what the fuck? I swear to God, I have one. In the closet I was talking about, man. It's right there. I think. This one is real money right here. This one is real money right here. I got my rank roulette golden medal from, from Harston. By the way, I have never received a trophy for winning the third season. Hello. What's this? I swear I have one though. What's this? I swear I have one though. Oh my god. It was just yeeted in a box. I, I, yeah, I have yeeted. Hello. That's it, no? 20 year anniversary StarCraft? That's the same coin, right? I came across, okay. I came across this one just now too. This one's also really cool. I don't know why I have this. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Battle Royale, Player Unknown's Battlegrounds? Dude, I am rich right here. I had no idea. I also have an ESL coin. But I think this is from the most recent cut of Itza. They actually started doing these at, at, at tournaments and stuff some time ago. Which is really cool. This one comes in like a little, a little pouch as well. Cool, right? Anniversary, 1998 to 2000. No, you just can't read, Rambo. That's okay. Um, I have another one. This one's still sealed, guys. That must mean it's worth a lot of money, no? <laughs> I don't know how this works. This 2018 community pin? Dude. Sealed is where it's at. I also have this. Also sealed, man. Only 400 bucks, it's yours. <laughs> it's like a, like a can opener. I don't know, with a StarCraft logo on it? I, I don't know. I have no idea why anybody would buy that for 350 bucks, though. That's that's insane. Guys, don't buy these for 350 bucks. Months of this kind of top tier. It's one of the rarest Blizzard coins you can find because this version would only send out to a select few people. Mate, I had no idea. Yeah, Wardy's holding out for at least a thousand dollars, man. He's not, he's not cheap. Wardy's thinking in Pokemon cards. How many packs of Pokemon cards can you buy for 350 bucks? Eh, not enough. Hey, thank you, Nut Brian, for the 14. I appreciate you. I'm sitting on a gold mine, bro. I had no idea. I don't know why anybody would buy it for that much, but fair enough. <laughs> How I remember what I need to do after my factory gas. Peck Rex. I really close to get her. You love people that make art. Covering when you tried to get attention from mode. He's a barrel, but he's text. He used it, okay? Wait, you got auto mod? I was in a carrot connoisseur. I need to watch that again. 225 on 2000? Look. Hey, uh, I missed a round of Queen and Jack. I think I got him, guys. Grandmaster ladder win rate? First thing I see. I haven't been there in a while. There must be... I actually haven't been on the Battle.net farms. They can deal damage to them for what's... I actually haven't been on the Battle.net farms in a while. Shall we take a little... I actually haven't been on the Battle.net farms in a while. Shall we take a little field trip? I haven't been there in a while. There must be something going on. General discussion. Rip, Zerk equals dead. Does anyone find it weird? This is the first thing I see. 
that Zerg's representation trend inverts inside of Grandmaster. This has to be the most Terran favorite map pool I've ever seen. How is Zerg doing in the ESL Cup? I love I love how people cherry pick their 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 results, right? Like that's always what kind of gets me. So this is obviously a, a post about Zerg being underpowered, but none of the top Zergs other than Dark play the ESL Open Cup. So like this is what you know this is what they come up with, right? This is how they they get it. But like none of the top level Zergs play the weekly cups. <laughs> what about Grandmaster ladder win rates? What about the win rates at the pro scene? Solar, I guess, plays as well, yeah. <sighs> this guy brings out math. Maybe Toby's a Terran. Brings out math. In case you're wondering what these win ratios equate and M. Brings out math. This guy brings out math. In case you're wondering what these win ratios equate math. In case you're wondering a Mar turn. Zerg gets minus 178. Terran gets Oh minus 178. Terran <laughs> Bro. <sighs> the thing about these discussions, it's be discussions, right? You see these discussions going on with basically anything. Right? Be it politics, be it whatever, right? And if you're not familiar with how things work, this may seem like a convincing argument. <laughs> right? But if Serral were to play in every argument, but if Serral were to play in every weekly cup, these stats would look entirely different. And that's just a single person making the difference. Has Serral retired? No, Serral just doesn't, just doesn't bother playing $200 tournaments. You gotta give at least a grant for Serral to show up every once in a while, okay? <laughs> Serral could dominate every single one of these, but he doesn't because he can't be bought. Um, so yeah, I, it's just uh, chair posting under results and then also posting under a barcode nickname. Look, I don't want to call anybody. Oh god, barcode nickname. I don't know what's up. He's just playing with guys. Sorry, can't stream. Um. Should I just give up? Feels like I will always just code nickname. Should I just give up? Feels like I will always just be a 4v4. What does this mean? Does anybody know what this means? My tactics fail miserably in 1v1. I get pwned by reapers, widow mines, roaches, etc. Just keep getting obliterated. Random team? What does NAB stand for? Oh, just noob? This is a skill issue, I fart. I hate to break it out. Uh, I hate to break it down for you like that, man. But I like I fart is the kind of guy who's making void rays in the corner of the map while playing full free force, which is fine. It's a fine way to play the game, but it's not going to do it very well in uh, one versus one. Gun versus DRG. Is everything with minimal Zerg being underpowered? Being underpowered. But anyways, after a while, never done a one a game. Four. Why is this unit so bad? Never even. Hey, it's the same guy. Three games of one few unit and lost the game, man. And out of all the units, he doesn't. <laughs> this was in 2007, before 2008. Monthly reminder that spreading creep. Is more micro than Terran Tulsa have to do the <laughs> monthly reminder that spreading creep? Is more micro than Terran Tulsa have to do the <laughs> entire game? What the fuck? I think. Spreading creep is not micro, okay? Spreading creep is definitely macro. I actually do believe that sp cr spreading creep is overpowered. I think creep spread is too strong in this game. They can't really change it anymore, but the amount of value creep spread provides is absolutely absurd. There's no way that we're ever going to see that again. This is just too much. Anyways, 
Have you considered that you might be going doing it wrong? I'll check your answer in a month. <laughs> Do something about cannon rushing. It's not that difficult to deal with, but spending 70 to 80% of your time facing a cannon rush isn't fun. Require a cybernetics core to build a cannon? There is no protos built that this simple change would alter except cannon rush. I guess that's true. It's pretty fun for the protos players though. Yeah, I think the protos players are enjoying it quite a bit. Rocker and other Grandmaster Protoses use Forge Fast Expend all the time. Is that the same barcode as earlier? Fast Expend a very long time. <laughs> FYI, the new Brute Zork player, holy cow. It's that same thousand forum posts. Look at the settings and... It's just an observation. There's in 23 years. <laughs> yeah, Alice, heal the mighty barcode. Now the developers seem to be able to generate items for seal, but don't... Game hasn't changed <laughs> uh, Heal the mighty barcode. True. When it first came out, the developers seem to have the technical ability challenges. Okay. I don't think there were co-op challenges in 23 years. But, or, or 23 years ago, but. What Zerk needs? <laughs> Queen anti-air is so low, it needs to be buffed. Right now they can push off pokes if lucky, but can't punish because they don't do enough damage. Banes need more HP, better macro script when burrowed. Overlord speed increase and drops need to be faster. Supply efficient unit in all of StarCraft though, man. Genuinely, there's... I, I would actually say that the Queens Banes and I'm probably Zerklings are the best unit Zerk has. Corruptors need to cost less. The fact that you need five corruptors, not that they're bad. It is the fact that for that you're paying for one unit. Same goes for the def cannons cost on my skill. Can you improve your the piece? <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what it is, uh, JP. Okay, so first off, right? The fact that you're paying almost double the cost to kill off one unit is insane. Low. <laughs> An asymmetrically balanced game, right? So Low. it's an asymmetrically balanced game. Is insane. It's an asymmetrically balanced game, right? So you're never gonna get the exact same cost. But what this guy is forgetting is that you need to make the starport, you need to make the tech lab, and you need to make the supply deep in order to make one battle cruiser. Like the battle cruiser supply depot count is quite significant. Same goes for defense structure. Cannons cost 100 apiece. They're 150 apiece. And it shoots both air and ground. Yet for a Zerg to have the equivalent, we have to spend 175 on a spine and spore. And then an additional 200 just for the workers to build it. And loss of mining time from the workers. Yeah, this guy is make, making uh, the W knighthood not look very good, white knight in the chat. A total of 375 minerals. It kind of... Quick math. It kind of, like... The forums kind of read, read similarly to clicking on, like, a random political tweet on Twitter and reading some of the reactions and some of the responses. Like, it reads very similarly to the point where you have people that live in the same country that you live in as well, right? Like, I clicked on a political tweet. Actually, it wasn't even a political tweet. It was a tweet from the Dutch royal family, right? They have a, they have a Twitter account. They just share pictures and stuff and uh, update every once in a while. It's kind of neat, right? Mate, you look at the reactions to some of those tweets and it's just embarrassing. You just see the same thing for every poll. Yeah, people just make shit up, man. People just make shit up and then post it. People just make shit up. up, man. People just make shit up. 
shit up. Get up and get up and get up and and then post it in a cool leave it to be true. But people do the same same on the forums, not correct. But a lot of people don't know, you know, the details of the game. So you like it, this is. I think you should probably keep this in mind, man. Whenever you read any political response anywhere on the internet, and people are talking about a subject that you don't know all the finer details about, just think back of the StarCraft II Battle.net forums, and you're like, "What the fuck?" So you're like, "What the fuck?" These. People are just saying things. They're just saying words that, you know, sound good in that order, but it makes no sense. <laughs> the community curated patch is community cheese. Right from the get-go, the patch has destroyed a lot of the early game cheese. It's destroyed a lot of the variety. I can't even read it. Is Zerk underpowered? Totals? Is Zerk underpowered? According to a <laughs> Okay. PVZ has a win rate of around 57% for Protals and around a 51 to 52% win rate for Terran in Terran versus Zerk. In other words, Zerk players are losing more than the other races. T Bone, man. Do you think Zerk is underpowered or do you think Zerk just has to figure it out what works for this patch? Game dead, Ritz, rip Starcraft, never heard anybody. The balance team will get that the same guy. Should I just give up on Stormgate? Oh, no, no, no. I thought that was a f what? Let's watch this two base Ulster map with Vino minimal. Parents today. Uh, if you spend too much time, dude, doctors you need to kill one battle cruiser. If it's the Rates, man. A little silly in the middle of the night. If Utopia, you missed it. No, play Final Fantasy. A lot. This is lame. It's a human. Final Fantasy 14. Look of fair trade. I'll play old school RuneScape if you play Final Fantasy 14. I heard Final. Look of fair trade. I'll play old school RuneScape if you play Final Fantasy 14. I heard Final Fantasy XIV is really fun. Can you play Final Fantasy XIV though without being a weeb? Because I don't know if I want to be a weeb, you know? No. Cheat. Be a weeb. What are. Cheat, that's what I'm saying. What other races you can play in Final Fantasy XIV? No. What other races you can play in Final I need to see pictures. Windowscentral.com. Is this good? Let's see. The higher. This is lame. It's a human. Midlander. Okay, this one is already a little bit more uwu. That's for sure. A Highlander. Okay, it's kind of like a Templar, but then. Elysian. Lame. Wildwood. <laughs> okay. Dusk White. Mikote? Seekers of the Sun. Oh, these have cat ears. Keepers of the Moon. Lalafell. The smallest of the races. Are these like the gnomes? Plains folk? They look like kids, dude. Can you play one that doesn't look like a kid? The Dunes Folk? Sea Wolves. Hellguard. Aura. Gnomes are shit. Lala's are shit too. You can make them with a beard? Okay. Ah. This is probably the, the most popular race, isn't it? I've got a feeling this is like the Blood Elf of Final Fantasy XIV. I haven't even seen them all yet. Xela? Oh, never mind. What about these guys?
The Vira? Vira? Oh. Yeah, okay, I see. Yeah, no, I see. I see how it is. Rava, Vina, Aliens. Do they shoot flames? The Lost? Dude, there's a lot. I kind of like the Lalafell. Lalafell seems kind of I kind of like the Lalafell. Lalafell seems kind of sick. It's a degenerate game, Loco. What? Are you calling my viewers degenerates? I mean, you'd be right, but like... We have everything from uwu girls to fur furries. Yeah, man. Nothing against that at all. I I've never never played Final Fantasy XIV. What I understand, the single player experience is actually really fun, and apparently the actual questing and storyline is actually interesting. I have seen a video on YouTube about degenerates in F Final Fantasy XIV. Yeah, it was basically the Final Fantasy XIV edition of Goldshire on an RP realm in World of Warcraft. Um, I don't think that really displays the average experience of World of Warcraft, and I don't think it really explained the average experience of Final Fantasy XIV either. You picked the cat girl race. Nice. Yeah, paladins in uh, in Goldshire on the role-playing realms, casting holy protection. <laughs> like, all right, all right, that's enough. That's enough World of Warcraft for today. Another Terran, another one. Right. 